We are live on YouTube now. What is going on, YouTube? How is everyone doing? Um, yeah, we're gonna. I haven't streamed on YouTube in a, in a minute, so we're we're back. We're back. We are back. Everyone, if you are watching this after the stream is over, comment down uh, "free Palestine" so I know that you made it or, or that you watched um, the stream after it's over. And I'll I'll heart your comments, maybe even reply to you. So uh, much love, much love. Make sure you leave a like on the stream as well. And we're going to be doing what we usually do. We're going to be speaking to Israelis about Palestine, about Palestine. And, you know, um, continue to expose the the truth, the truth and, and and the reality of what is actually going on in Palestine. And, um, and, and yeah, so, so that, I mean, that's what we always do. So we're going to continue to do that. Um, we got Aaron in the chat. We got Sarina in the chat. I'm reading the YouTube chat now. What is going on, YouTube chat? What is going on? Let's wait for some more people to get in here, and then we're gonna get started. Inshallah. Um, it was a it was a perfect amount of time to drive home. That's amazing, Rochelle. I'm glad that you could have that you made it to the stream. I'm glad it was perfect. I'm glad we are we're here right now, and we're gonna get this stream started. Okay, everyone, double tap the stream if you're on TikTok though. Double tap the stream because TikTok loves censoring Palestine content, Palestine videos, so uh, or even streams. So please double tap the stream, get the likes to like 20,000 likes or something to start the stream off, and we should be good. And we should be good. The stream sh should start getting promoted more so more people see the truth. Okay? Yalla. Yalla, let's do this. Let's do it. Everyone say Bismillah, Bismillah, Bismillah. We're about to get started here. We're about to get started. I know it's Shabbat. I know it's Shabbat. Uh, and it's Saturday in, in, in uh, you know, the Zionist uh, state. But, uh, or it's Saturday everywhere. But um, we've streamed on Saturdays before and, and people still come on. So let's see what happens. <sighs> let's see what happens. Let's, let's see what happens. Bismillah. Because, by the way, just to explain, Shabbat is... Um, a holiday and uh, basically all, all like I guess an 80 percent of Israel uh, celebrates it where and it's where you cannot go on on tech on any technology for the whole day um, I, I, I think they also fast I'm not entirely sure all I know is that they don't go on technology because um, I, I, I had to figure that out myself when I was on here on a Saturday and no one was popping up but some some people may still be here, like Israeli soldiers. That's like mainly who's on here on on Saturdays, which is insane, by the way. So let's see what happens. I think I missed the live. No, no, no. We are live right now. You did not miss the live. We are live right now. You did not miss anything. We are getting started right now. We are getting started as we speak. Okay. Okay. I I'm ready. I'm ready. Bismillah. <sighs> okay. Hello? If you guys cannot hear them, let me know, by the way. <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't like doing this. Hello? Oh, no one's there. Hello? Red. What? Red. Red? Gas or ass. Okay. I don't know what she was talking about, but okay. Hello? That guy was from Israel, but it didn't load. His, his, uh, his, his camera didn't work. Hello? Hello? Oh, oh, oh. oh, hello. Hi. He's he's from Palestine. So I have to So I have to sure. make sure. Yeah. What? What? What, bro? Where are you from? Where are you from? It's not your fucking business. Shut up. Where are you from? <laughs> Where are you from? It's not your business. Are you from Israel? Are you from Israel? No. Where? Where? Palestine. Palestine? Palestine? It, yes, that's it, right. It is my business, ya habibi. Ya habibi. 
Ah, oh, skip me. <laughs> Damn. Damn. <laughs> well, that's not a good look. <laughs> uh, he probably thought I was uh, pro-Israel or something. Hello, hello. 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 Hi, where are you from? Israel. Oh, wow. Are you IDF soldier? Yes. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, well, uh, have you have you ever killed any Palestinians? Not yet. Not yet? Yeah. Do you wish to kill Palestinians? No. So Only why? the terrorist guy. Okay, so why not yet? Because this, I, you ask me a question, I uh -huh. tell you. Yeah, you said not yet. Okay. Um, that's in, that's that's yes. weird though. That's what you guys are killing Palestinians in Gaza with bombs right now. No. Yeah. It's bullshit. Don't no. believe to bullshit. But thirty thousand Palestinians have been bombed so far in Gaza. No, it's not good. Be really Only the, the Hamas guy. Oh, oh, so thirty thousand Hamas. Yeah. Wow. So ten thousand kids are Hamas. Yeah. Ten ten thousand kids were killed. Are they Hamas? Um, the Hamas uh, maybe take him. You understand? But but Israel I... is bombing Gaza. Israel's killing them. What do you mean? No children. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think yeah. So. Ten thousand children have been killed so far by Israel in Gaza. No, it's not true. This is true. I see the bodies. I see the people. There's names for them. Is it? Is it? Is it? You know, you know where you know where I'm from. You know where I'm from. You know, I just say, yeah. I'm from Palestine. Where is it, Palestine? You're on Palestine right now. No. Yeah, no. yeah. I don't know something like that, Palestine. Uh huh. I don't know Israel. You know Gaza. Gaza? Ah, you from Gaza? No, Gaza is Palestine in the West Bank. You know the West Bank? You know Ramallah and Beit Lahem? No, no, no you... Gaza is not Palestine. Gaza is Hamastan. Gaza, Gaza is what? Hamastan. What is that? This is a country Hamastan called in Al Gaza. Look at you. Have you ever killed any Palestinians? Can I talk to him? Never. No, no, no yet. Not yet. You want to kill Palestinians? No. Just Hamas. Oh, okay. So no no civilians. No, civilians never. Oh, okay, but 10,000 kids were killed in Gaza. What do you think about that? Are they Hamas? I think, I think because Hamas take the children and uh, like a shield. He oh, like a, a shield. shield. The chicken shield is uh, you take the kids and hide after the back of the kids. But that's not true. This is true, true. It's not true, though. That that it's never true. happened. There's it's no true. proof of that either. Uh, a lot of proof. We have, uh, we have films. Can you show me? I, I don't have that uh, yet. Ah, okay, okay. We, we uh -huh. we no, no, it's fine. Film. You don't have the proof because it doesn't exist. Uh -huh. We see what what your opinion about uh, uh, all the rape and the ki children killed in uh, in Israel? Yeah, the, well, there's no, there's no substantial uh -huh. there is no substantial what? evidence. There is I'm talking I'm talking. The, Let me talk. The, the UN, there is no substantial yeah, evidence look, of rape on October seventh. Uh, listen, listen. Look the news. The UN. I'm looking at the news. The UN actually they came out yes. and there's documentation of, of Israel, Palestinians being raped by Israelis. Still, we have children kidnapped in Gaza, right? We, we have, have. What are you talking about? In Gaza, hostages? In Gaza, yes. Children, Israeli children kidnapped in Gaza, is right or not? Yes, and you guys are bombing Gaza. Don't you want to save them? No, no, no. I, I, I ask you a quick question. Yeah, I'm saying yes. You know about women. Uh, old women, old uh, old people in Gaza. You know about that or not? I'm telling you, yes. There are hostages in Gaza, and there are also hostages right. in the okay. West Bank. So, it's still Palestinians. When I have one hostage in Gaza, uh, to take this hostage back, 
if you win, we need to destroy Gaza, we need to destroy Gaza. You understand? You're going to destroy Gaza now? If, if don't give the, the people back, we uh -huh. destroy all Gaza. Okay. And then so, after that, Ramallah also. Oh, oh really? Understand? Ramallah next? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So if they, yeah. if so, if they, okay. Yeah, sway, sway. Don't, don't, Ca well, calm, nobody calm down, can calm mess down. with us and come, come free. No, nobody. Nobody can mess with, okay, calm down, calm down. There are hostages in. I, I, you're you're, you're grabbing your gun like you want to do something. Calm down. Shui shui, okay? No, no shui shui. Okay. Let me say something. No, I don't want to speak Arabic with you. Ashan, you are, uh, you are, you are, Khanzir, uh, listen. In Gaza, there are hostages. Yeah, wallah, you are. There are hostages in Gaza. Whatever, bro. And you are bombing Gaza. There are hostages in Gaza and you're bombing Gaza. You're not listening. He skipped me. <laughs> they're crazy they're crazy wallah wallah hiwanat they're crazy they are cr they're insane <laughs> hello hello <laughs> i i no one saw that right <laughs> what the fuck what the f <laughs> no one saw that no one saw that uh, but you heard it. But but it was uh, Fortnite. They were, they were playing a game. Hello, hello. Don't skip me. Don't skip me. They they were uh, playing Fortnite, guys. They were playing Fortnite with the the sound you just heard. Someone was playing Fortnite, and they were like, they they were just uh, uh, they were doing so well in the game. They they made some noise. I don't know. Uh, hello, where are you from? Hello, hello where are you from? I'm from India. What's up, man? How you doing? What's up, man? How you doing? Right on. You are a YouTuber? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, what is your name? Hamza. H-A-M-Z-A-H. H-A-M-Z-A-H. Okay, what is your channel name? Hamza. H-A-M-Z-A-H. H-A-M-Z-A-H. We are searching. Okay, thank you. The okay, echo is bad, though. bad, though. I have to leave. I have Can to leave. Can you repeat? Can you repeat? The, the echo. The echo. Spelling, please. The echo. Jacko. Ah, uh, yeah, uh, it's bad. Yeah, it's bad. Jacko. Okay. <laughs> I had to actually make it echo uh, for him to understand what I meant. But I mean, it was echoing originally. Okay, whatever. Never mind. <laughs> Hello. Damn, that was aggressive. Aggressive skip. Hello. That those IDF soldiers were crazy, by the way. I don't know how we're just moving on from that, but that was insane. <laughs> that was crazy. He like in the beginning he was PR trained and he was like, no, we only kill Hamas. But he was holding back so much. Uh, but then as soon as he found out Palestine, uh, I'm, I'm from Palestine and all of these things, uh, and I spoke Arabi, he started saying, uh, or maybe it was before I started speaking Arabi. I don't know, but he started saying, we're gonna destroy all of Gaza and then and then Ramallah. They're crazy. And then they're saying 10,000 kids didn't get killed. And the first guy said that 10,000 kids were Hamas. And then this guy's saying they're human shields. Insane. Insane. Free Palestine with the Wanda. Thank you so much on TikTok. Thank you. I appreciate that. I need to drink some water. They are psycho. They are crazy. Hello? What's up, bro? What's up, bro? What's up, man? Where are you from? From Brazil, bro. That's cool, man. I'm from Palestine. Palestine. Yeah. You, you're, oh, they just banned me on TikTok, bro. My bad. I have to go. They banned me on TikTok. Are you kidding? <sighs> Man. They banned me on TikTok. Do you guys notice? How they banned me when I'm speaking about Palestine, but in my I, I streamed before this on TikTok for two hours. They did not ban me because I wasn't speaking about Palestine as much. But now that I speak about Palestine, like directly about it, they're just gonna remove me like that. Really, really disgusting, disgusting. L TikTok in the chat, L TikTok in the chat, man. So crazy how they do that. It's it's just it's so like why? Like why actually why? 
The censorship is crazy. Also, if anyone wants to support the channel a little more, we have memberships on YouTube um, and you guys can become a member. Uh, it, it, it directly supports me and it would mean the world to me. It directly supports the channel, um, helps me push out these videos more, these streams. Um, and obviously it's not, it's not required, it's not needed, but it is obviously appreciated, 100%. So, if you guys would, if you want, if you want. But yeah, I just wanted to announce that real quick. In the meantime, while I appeal the ban on, on TikTok. I'm trying to get unbanned now. It's so crazy though. Like why? Like why actually? L TikTok. It's 24k with the membership for one month. Level 2 supporter by the way. Saying I'm a member. Thank you. Let's get some hype in the chat for 24k. Hearts in the chat for it's 24k. its 24 k Let's get love in the chat for him. Thank you. Means a lot. Well, that means a lot. Thank you. Almost two months. Thank you, man. I'm waiting for them to unban me, man. This is crazy. I'm gonna make another video real quick on TikTok. Yo, what's going on, guys? Hamza here. Uh, I was just streaming on TikTok about Falastine, and and as always, they ban me. So I'm gonna appeal the ban. Inshallah, they they approve it and give my access back, and I'll be back soon. Inshallah. Free Palestine. Let me make, let me add something actually. Oh, also, hold on. Also, I'm live on YouTube if I'm not live on TikTok. So come over to youtube.com slash Hamza Saada or just search up Hamza Saada on YouTube. Okay, catch you later. Next, Free Palestine caption. And then post it. Yeah, man, they keep doing this. I have to like let people know because some people don't know I'm live on YouTube at the same time. So I have to... Sorry about this. Technical difficulties, guys. Let's let's just do one more. Let's do one more in the meantime. Hello, don't skip me. Hello. No one saw that, right? Okay. Hello. Hello. Carlos. Hi, hi. Where are you from? Mexico. Mexico. I'm from Palestine. Oh, you're not. You're not Carlos. What? You're Omar. Uh, Omar. Free Palestine. Black Lives Matter. Hold on. Okay. Hello. Hi. Okay. Bye. Did they approve it? It's been three minutes. No. Hello? Oh wow, this guy doing the smoking, smoky, smoky, not good. Not good. Hello? See, I told you, I told you, IDF soldiers are on on Saturdays. <laughs> you, the, the majority of the people from Israel that you're going to see on Saturdays are the IDF on this website. I told you guys. Are you tired, bro? Yeah, I need some dick. You need some what? Dick. Bro, you look like a YouTuber that I... Mm, you look like an actual YouTuber. Uh, who do I look like? I don't know, man, but you look like... Good. He wears the same wear glasses and shit, bro. Oh. Wait, are you talking about... um? Yes, curly hair. Um, a a Adapter. There you fucking go. Adapter. <laughs> Yo, I, I know him. I know him. Everyone says I look like him. Wait, is it really? Is that you? I'm Adapter, bro. It's me. It's no. me. I'm Adapter. No, you're not, bro. How you doing? How you doing? Is it actually? Yeah, that's me, man. No, nah, bro. Hold on. You, nah, you fucking with me. Hold on. Nah, nah. That's, that's me, shit. bro. That's me. Nah, it ain't really. Nah, on, search up on. Adapter live stream on YouTube. You'll find it, bro. You'll find it. Uh, it ain't you right now. Yup. Nah, I doubt it, man. <laughs> I'm just kidding, man. It, it's it's Hamaza. Hamaza? Yeah, Hamaza. Ha, ha, Hamaza. Uh, uh, KH? Bro, I'll start with the K. Huh? KH? Yeah, that's my name, bro. KH? Are you laughing at how my name's spelled? KH. <laughs> AM. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. AZ. Uh -huh. AZ. AZ. AH. Uh -huh. 
A H? Yeah. Is it? Yeah, Hamaza. Are you streaming right now? Yeah. On what? YouTube. I don't see it though. I'm just kidding, man. I'll, I'll type the real one in the chat. Just take it, bro. <laughs> What'd you say? Bro. bro. Bro's like like the whitest man I've ever seen. Nah. Oh, I'm going to see myself. <laughs> oh, there's me. Yep. Hey. Yo, I'll sing for y'all. I'll sing for y'all. You're going to sing for us? Okay, bet. Uh. What are you gonna uh, wait, wait? What are you gonna sing though? Demi Falastini? What, what? What are you singing? What? What? What can I say? What can I not say? What can you not say? Yeah. Uh, bad words. Sorry. Bad words. No bad words. Yeah. I mean, give me a second. I mean, you said you said like the worst bad word ever, but oh, I'm, I'm it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Okay, can I say titties or not? N no. Oh, <laughs> I, I don't got a song for you then. I don't got a song for you then. What? You don't have a so you need no. to say that word to uh to sing? Yeah, basically, man. I gotta hold you. It's so weird, bro. It ain't weird, man. That's it's, weird. Okay, fine. I'll I'll let you use it. So let's just if it sounds like terrible, I'm gonna skip though. If it's like not terrible as in like your voice, as in like it's inappropriate. Uh it's like three words, man. Five. Okay, let me, let's hear it. Just adds up. It has a missing string. I don't sing. I don't play the guitar. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I wanna see your titties. What? All right. I'm just gonna skip, bro. I'm just gonna fucking skip. My bad, chat. My bad. My bad, bro. I wasn't. In, I didn't know that was gonna happen. Um, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. I shouldn't have. Um. Yeah, my bad. <laughs> my ears are bleeding now. <laughs> uh, you know what? It is his voice, too. <laughs> I, I said I, it wouldn't have been his voice, right. but it's like everything. Everything was... There was so much wrong with that. <laughs> Hello? Oh, damn, bro's ripped. He's like flexing, too. Like what? Yeah, I'm ripped. He's like, can't breathe. He can't breathe. <laughs> he looks so stiff. Hello? Did TikTok approve the ban? Let me check. No, not yet. It's still in the, like, it's still pending. So it's eight minutes. It's been eight minutes and I, I appealed it. Usually it's either, it's either instant or it takes a long time and then they decline it. So I'm probably getting declined. <laughs> Okay. She was vibing. She was vibing. Okay. Yo. Is that orbs or orba? No. It's adapter, bro. What? Adapter. That's my name. That's cat, bro. Okay, I'm just kidding. It's or 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 orzaga or orzaga. Man, what, what what were you saying? Orbs? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> He's trying to say absorber. Oh man, orbs. Orbs is crazy. My name is Adapter, though. Said so. You just assume I'm not being sincere, and that's it. Damn, they're fighting. They're fighting. You know, she's she's mad at someone. She is mad at someone. How do you know I'm a train? What? What? Hello, what's up? What's up? How you doing? <gasps> Absorber, man. No, my name's Adapter. Dude, I swear to God, I used to watch you <laughs> back, back, back. Hey, dude. man, I appreciate you, dog. Thank you. What's your name? It's Khalib. Khalib. But I tried, but I tried contacting you on through your number, but it didn't work. Oh, damn. Damn. It, I mean, it should work. That's like my um. If it's my other number for for fans and stuff but yeah i tried i don't know man hey man i, I really though. love you bro hey i appreciate you man khalib man hey, thank you have a great day bro you hey, too, hey, man. hey man you take it easy uh huh put a shirt on though i'm <laughs> just kidding i'm kidding don't skip don't skip don't skip, don't skip. where are you from you don't remember me 
Nah, you don't have a very memorable face. What's going on, though? I'm fine. Uh, Last time we spoke, you called me a monster, and then you skipped me. Oh, what did you say? Why would I call you a monster? Oh, I don't know. I didn't curse you, and I didn't say... Wow, did you curse the Palestinian people? Maybe wish death upon them, or, or say 10,000 kids should be killed? I don't know. But, because I don't call anyone that doesn't say that a monster. Kids and kids and kids, because there is not only kids. Oh, there, the, there's women. The there's women, too. There's um uh, uh, men as well. There is an animal like you also. I'm an animal? I don't know. You called me monster, so I have to... I called you monster uh, when? Exactly. Last time? So you want to find me again to call me an animal? If I no, called no, you a monster, there's a reason I would call you a monster. I don't call anyone a monster. If I called you a monster, there's a reason. You said something. Oh, I've, yeah? But I, so genu I genuinely... I'm calling you an animal. Why am I... I'm asking you, why am I an animal? Because you are uh, support Hamas. I support Palestine. I support my pal the Palestinian people. I support the Palestinian you struggle. Said, you said last time that you are Hamas. When did I say I was Hamas? I can show you if you want. Please show me. And if I was being like sarcastic, there's no way you took that serious. Did I say I was? Uh, did, I, did I say what I Did I say I was, did, did about, say I was Abu Monday? Did I say yeah, I was no, no, Abu no, Monday? Let me, let me speak also. <laughs> let me because you speak. You you are controlling this. Uh, this lie, but let me speak also, you know, I have my own opinions also, not like, not just you. You say sarcastic, but speak, what about yeah. the people you're talking, what about the people in Israel you are talking with, and you don't say the sarcastic, they say, oh, they they not even hiding it when they say they uh, trying to make uh, uh, something bad to Palestinians. What? That's not sarcastic. Well, I don't even know what you're saying. When, when, when people say, uh, they kill Palestinian kids. What you want me to say? Oh, they're being sarcastic. It's uh, it's not sarcastic. We've been we've been uh, uh, bombing and rocket and and people uh, killed and raped here and got uh, slaughtered. And you say no, it's uh, you asking. What do you think about the children from Palestine? Yeah, Are you serious. Yes, serious? yes, I am serious. Why, why Ten thousand kids. Hamas? Why are not condemning Hamas? Because I'm that's not what we should be doing right now. Kids are dying oh, yes. in Gaza. Ten thousand kids have died, been killed. People died in Israel also. I don't know if you know. Yeah, October seventh. I know, and and I don't agree with any innocent killing of any life. I don't. What? Say it. Say, I just Hamas. did. Hamas. What? That's not what we should be. That's like not the topic at all. The topic is ten thousand kids have been killed, and we need to cease fire now. Innocent people are being killed. That's the topic. What? What is this about condemning Hamas? Will I save anyone condemning Hamas? Will me condemning Hamas save Palestinian lives, or will that only justify Israel to keep bombing them? Tell me. Tell me. What will that do? We not. We not. Uh, we Come not, on, uh, man. Uh, be serious. No, be serious. I'm serious. This I'm is serious. why I called you a monster. You propaganda. I'm talking sp uh, the most sincere 10, 10, way 10,000 10, kids didn't die? Didn't get killed? Why they died? Is there a reason? It's the res responsibility of Hamas. Is, is there a reason for 10,000 kids to be killed by Israel? Is there a reason why we have hostages in Gaza? No. Is there a reason why you told me we need... I, I, I'm, tell, I'm telling you that are there reasons that, that there are prisoners, there are hostages as well, Palestinian hostages in yes, and, and, and and, and Israeli hostages. prisons. They're not, they're not hostages, they did crimes. And, and if, is there a reason for uh, for the hostages in, in, in Gaza? Well, my answer to that is uh, look at the history of Palestine, of Palestine. Look at the history of the Nakba. Look, look, look at the history of the Six Day War. Look at the history of all of this. Okay, before 1948, Palestine had a society, had a culture, had a people, right? The Zionist movement took that over yeah. and, and displaced 750,000 Palestinians we didn't, we didn't and killed tens of thousands. The UN, Let me talk. The UN, the U, the, you, the UN never went through. You. The UN partition plan of 1947, 1948 never went through. Look it up. 
Do because your research. You are, because you, atta- you attacked us and we won. We No, the Arabs, won, Arabs, again, the Palestinians again, rejected again, it. And again, and we, and we, the and Palestinians rejected it. What I'm telling you is context. I'm giving you context on why days like October 7th happened to begin with. Why Hamas exists in the it's, first place. It's, right? It's not justified. Yes, you said I'm not justifying it. I'm not. As I told you. As I told you in the beginning, I don't agree with any innocent killings. I'm not justifying it. I'm giving you context. I'm giving you historical context, important historical context. This is something you need to know. October 7th, Hamas did not come out of a vacuum. This is not uh, random, okay? 1987 is when Hamas created itself, right? 1948 is the Nakba. That's 30 years before. I'm saying something. Do you care about your people? And I was also saying that 40 years before. In Gaza, in Gaza right now. Of course now? I care about my people. I mean, what kind of there question is, is that? There is a terrorist in Gaza, you know that? Yeah, IDF is in Gaza right now. They're killing Palestinians. Yes, yes. Who will, oh, who will, sorry. Uh, destroy, who will destroy them, the terrorism? Uh, the IDF? Who Who's who going to kill IDF? Oh. Who's going to kill IDF? I don't I don't know. I mean, no. you guys are like, strong, who so... Who's going to destroy the, uh, Hamas? I, I thought you were talking about. I thought you talking about. I thought you were talking about the IDF. You said the terrorists, right? The terrorist is Hamas. Yes. The IDF, the Isra- Israeli army. IDF is the most humanity uh, uh, army in the world. They really? Never, they're the is... most moral army yeah. in the whole entire world, right? Yeah. So they're gonna kill yeah. ten thousand kids. They're not killing ten thousand kids. That's a lie. So you how many? That. So if, what happened if, to those kids? Did is, they just did they just wait, despawn? Wait. Is this Minecraft? Is, did they despawn? If there is, if there is a kids who uh, died in a bombing because you, the people you're supporting using them as a human shield, you know that. L- let, me let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. If the let me let me let me tell you something. There is no proof yeah. of Hamas using human shields. Number one. But let me continue. Don't interrupt. Let me continue. There is, let there me is continue. There let me continue. There, is there, there isn't. There isn't. There we isn't. Building, there isn't. Building, but let me. But let me people. tell you something. They say, no, there I'm isn't. Not about- there isn't. But let me tell you something. If the leader, the leader of Hamas, enters a hospital in Palestine in Gaza, you should not bomb it. Still, even if the leader of Hamas Until enters the the hospital, no, that's a, not true. That's that's a lie. It is not under international law that you can do it if, if Hamas is in the, the hospital. That's a lie. If Hamas using this hospital that's as a lie. base and putting the rocket Th- and... That's, uh, that, you, you're lying to yourself. You're lying to yourself. You're lying to yourself. There is no reason to bomb a hospital. What you're telling me is a lie. There is no reason to bomb a hospital. There is no reason to bomb a church or, or, or a mosque or a school or a refugee if, camp. If if there is no reason, there is no justification. Let me ask okay, you a question. So, Let me ask you a question. So, okay. Let me ask you a question. Uh, you're lying. You're I'm going to ask you a question. Viewer. I'm going to ask you a question. I'll let you talk after this question. I'll let you talk. I'll let you talk. I'll, I'll give you some time, um, even though you guys had 75 years. But I'll give you some more time. Sure. If Hamas, uh, let yes. me speak, yes. let me speak, let me speak. Take, don't, just don't t- 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 take the hit, take the hit, bro. Head. Take the hit, take the hit. You're, 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 you're being uh, puny, bro. Just, t- just take the hit. Listen, if Hamas, if Hamas took the hostages and went into a hospital in Israel, a Jewish hospital with Jewish doctors, Israeli doctors, right? If Hamas went into an Israeli hospital, should they bomb the Israeli hospital? Should the IDF bomb the Israeli hospital? I think they did something worse. Should they or should they not? Should they what? Bomb this hospital? Israeli hospital. Why? Hamas is inside of it. But with Israeli doctors, Israeli patients, should they bomb it? We're not, we're not bombing because Hamas is inside. <laughs> uh, you we're just said that. You just said that they're the using them as human the shields. And this, and oh. this hospital became... Good oh, job, man. good job, no, good job. I mean, that just proved a lot. No, that, that just proved I, a lot. I, that I, just I proved a lot. Maybe you're looking for that. The that just you just exposed yourself. Okay, can I ask you a question? 
Can I ask you a question? No. Hamas is in a hospital in Gaza. Where are you from? I'm from Palestine. I'm from Palestine. Yes, you are from Gaza. You know that. No, I'm from Palestine. You said that you're from Gaza. If I was from Gaza... I'm not not from Gaza. I'm not from Gaza. I'm not from Gaza. You are from Gaza. I'm from the West Bank. Say where are you from? The West Bank. The West Bank. You are from the West Bank? I'm from the West Bank. The West Bank exists, you know? You can go there. Yay! Gaza also exists, but it's being bombed. What's your point? So go to Gaza and help the people you you you, you support. They're being go, genocided. Go I can't go because the leader is is hiding under the under the ground while the kids is sitting. The, uh, the, the, uh, okay, uh, the, the, the the leader, the leader of Hamas, is under a hospital in Gaza. Should we bomb the hospital? No. Why? Why bump the hospital? That's what's happening. Leader. That's what's happening. No, no. I should have asked it the other way around. He would have said on, yes to this and no to we that. Have we have a proof. I mean, he justified we it find, earlier anyways, bombing hospitals. So he, he said human we find, shields. We find under, underground at the hospital, we found a, a, a bomb, we found a grenade, and we found a, a lot of... Uh, okay, okay. If Hamas, if Hamas had rockets under the hospital... Should they bomb it? If it's if it's considered as a, as a should they bomb the hospital? If Hamas has uh, some rockets, if Hamas has some rockets under a hospital, should they bomb it? If if it's considered yes or no, by the, by the, I'm asking. No, I'm no, no, no. It's a yes or no. No, man, you are. Uh, yes you're or no? Twist, you're trying to twist everything. It's I'm not, not twisting. I, I, it's a simple your, question. Your observation is like. Yeah. Okay. If you find grenade, should we who should we bomb this hospital? That's what you're saying. I what? Right? You said if we find the grenade in the hospital, should we bomb this hospital? That's what you're saying, right? Well, that's what's happening. <laughs> no, that's not that's not what's happening. Th- then and, what's and happening? The, and the IDF is not killing children. We're not aiming okay, children. Okay, okay. Everything you're if saying is just like I, I, the animals is support do this. I, I mean, they killed our children. 10,000 children have been killed in Gaza. And you know how much children died here? How many? In the most, how worst many? way. How many? They put, they put how many? How many? Over. You said how many? I'm they asking put, you how many. It's not a numbers over. game. It's not a numbers game, but how many? You know what? It's not oh, numbers exactly. game. Okay, 10,000 kids have been people killed. There were also kid, kids. There were, Listen, uh, uh, what, I, I, I don't agree with any innocent killing. I'm telling you. I don't. I'm telling you that. I'm telling you that. What is your solution? How? how Israel, cease, cease fire now. Listen, listen, Israel and then negotiations. But the negotiation, they asking to release murderer, 3,000 murderer from the jail. Do you understand what, that? What kind of negotiation it is? Do, You're do, not supporting killing their murderer. Can I tell you something? Tell can I tell you something? There are children and women in that um, so-called jail, right? Prison. As prisoners, okay. they are hostages. Okay. They, the, the Palestinians are hostages. Okay. They are not prisoners. Is, let me let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. There are over a thousand of the Palestinian prisoners in Israeli prisons from the West Bank that have not been charged for a single crime. You understand you know that? What? No, no, no. Yes, yes. So those are hostages. Those are not prisoners. Yes or no? There is not. There is no justification for uh, for hostages, innocent hostages. That's what I'm saying. There are and okay. There are innocent hostages. My my hostages are also innocent. My hostages. Well, are, some are IDF soldiers, are, are, are and old, I won't. Con- I don't consider them babies. innocent. We have a babies hostages. We have. Do you have a, a babies hostages in our jail? Uh, you kill ten thousand babies. We're playing in the in the jail rule. That's what you're saying. You kill ten thousand babies you, you they, instead of jailing them. That's what you're saying. What? You say you say well, like we're playing in the in the jail rules. If you do something, we do something worse than you. Like we're gonna get radical. That's what you're saying. I'm not sure I understand. There, there is a kids. There is a kids. Host, a Palestinians kids hostage hostages in in our jail. Tell me. There's a what? Palestinians a, baby. Palestinian Palestinians ba- baby. There, there are me. there are children under eighteen. Babies, babies. There are children under eighteen. Babies, I don't know. Babies. <laughs> Calm down. I said there are children under eighteen. Okay. If there yeah. is a children under under eighteen, and and, I and, I'm, and I'm sure there are babies. I mean, IDF is pretty fucking insane. So they killed ten thousand kids. One years, one years old. 
Do you know the Reddit uh, kid that I, hostages I, right now in the... Okay, okay, stupid. okay. What, what you're saying is, is, is unfortunately irrelevant Unfortunate. because, because yes. it, it does not... No, what I'm saying it's a, it's irrelevant to the to the fact that uh, ten thousand kids have been killed, right? And, and thirty thousand Palestinians have been killed. And if you listen, if you if you care so much about the hostages, call for a ceasefire. Do you not want them to stay alive? Our hostages? Yeah. Our hostages. It's it's the main it's the main purpose of the war. I don't know if you understand. No, it's not. When we, it, when I'm, we, that's why I'm telling you it's irrelevant. But I'm telling you it's irrelevant because the IDF does not give a shit about them. They killed three of their own hostages. Tell me how they care about them. I said, I said that before and I said it again. It was an accident. Accident. This, those three, Come on, accident, man. Be yeah. serious. And we saved, Be we serious, saved man. Two. We saved. We saved. Two. Be serious. Yeah, you're also giving aid to the Palestinians you're bombing. So, come on. Well, make it make sense. Say it again. You're bombing Palestinians and then you give them a band-aid. Band-aid? You know aid? I'm not, I'm not, I'm not giving you some... Me medical supplies? Okay, yes. Yes. When you bomb... So how... It just doesn't make any sense. You're going to, like, uh, rip someone's arm off and then and delimb yes, them and then give them, a, like, what? What are you going to give them? Uh, they're, they're gone. Tell us. I'm, I'm going to say that. They're going to die because there's no medical... What are you... Oh, my God. I'm going to say that in a very relaxed way. Listen. He's not understanding. It's okay. Yes, there is. Listen. Yes, there is what? You're still not even understanding. I don't know why, what you're saying. You're saying that like very, very quiet that I'm not going to hear like you are trying to be sarcastic. I'm not being, I'm no. saying you're not understanding I'm, me. I'm not I'm being sarcastic. The main, <laughs> it's the main purpose. It's the hostages. When we get, we go, it's we're going to get the hostages. It's not. We're going to left. We're going to left. How did you know? I didn't know. I live in because, Israel. Okay. I've been in the IDF. I know how, 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 how we work. You've been in the yeah, military. you know how you work. You're saying that 10,000 kids weren't killed. Come on, man. No, no. We don't want to kill kids. We, we, so, it's not our, it's so, not so, our purpose. So how many kids got killed? If, if they died, if they died, it's the responsibility of Hamas. So how many kids, created, so how many kids got killed? Situation. So how many kids got killed so far? How, how many kids? How many? How many? Our people got killed so far? Tell okay, me. So you, so you don't even want to answer my you question. You know? Thousands. Do you thousands, want... yeah. You know that? Th oh, you don't know? Thousands? I'm I'm doing your, your thing. Oh, you don't know? What? I asked you if you, you knew know? if you know how, how many how much people kids died, died in the Hamas invasion of on 7th of October. You care? You don't care. How many? Tell me. You 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 care? Uh, how many? 1200. I know how many. 3000. No. Yes. That's a lie. No, that's not a lie. Yes, it is. 1200 were killed. I mean, but but either way, it's not a numbers game. I don't agree with any innocent killings. Unlike you, you're trying game, to exaggerate it and make people not really care about it as much. Three thousand did not get killed. They they got killed. Yes, in a, in a very Israelis, way. Israelis, Israelis. Yes. How how many babies? How many babies? I don't know the the, well, the, like, the what? number. Probably probably correctly. 500, right? Probably 500? I don't know the numbers correctly, but it doesn't you're, matter. You're, Even you're, one you're, 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 you're making these you're numbers up. Me. You're making these numbers up. Unfortunately. I mean, it's, that's just not true. Do you understand that's not true? I understand it's, it's true, yes. 3,000 3, were killed? I don't know. Last time we talked, you didn't even upload this video, so maybe I, I said I don't... something. Something, something that you I, are I, 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 No, I probably posted it as a VOD if I streamed it on YouTube. And, and I'll have you know that I don't post everyone I talk to because long conversations like this doesn't fit on TikTok or Instagram. Yes, but on YouTube, they're fit. Okay, I'm telling you, if I streamed it on YouTube, it's still there. I, 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 don't, I don't remove if, my, my, my streams unless there's there like is, nudity there or anything like that, which happened in my last stream. You post nudity? No, when I come up to people and if, if oh, I... If, if, like that, like that. Listen, Hamza, if there is, a, 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 a like you said kids and uh, uh, people who are in, in in israel jail and they're innocent i support them to be released but there are there are thousands of them must, you must you you must understand that until it's uh, uh, benjamin Netanyahu talking about this every time that we that he's trying to make a settlement with hamas which is which is ha the, the biggest well, well no but, but well, let's, let's put it no but, no we're not going to put that to the side because let me just clarify 
Uh, you're gonna put it aside because no, no, no. Because let me let me clarify people. what you're saying. I cannot let you move on when you're like kind of wrong. So Netanyahu oh, did finish. offer let stuff. Let me finish. No, because you said you put it to the side. Let me let me let me answer that. Hold on, man. So Netanyahu. It's okay. It's okay. The settlement with Hamas. Settlement with the terrorists. You're not even listening, dude. You want to let me speak? I want to let you speak. But okay, then they, let me fucking speak. Let me speak then. Let me speak. Don't hurt, don't, H Hamas? No, 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 my God, bro. What? Why, why cursing? Because you're not letting me speak. Just let me speak. So it's okay? So I can curse you also? You're not letting me I'm speak not cursing also? at you. I'm not cursing you. You saying you saying the f the the f word? The f word? Oh no! Did I hurt your feelings? I didn't even fucking use it at you. Yeah. Like yeah, using it right there? Feelings. I'm not using it you at you. I'm not. Feelings. I'm not directing. I'm not saying f you. I'm not. I never said that. Calm down. Your feelings are like you're so sensitive. Yes, also, yeah, yeah. Sway, sway, I, bro. I, I don't. I don't like it. Okay. You don't like it? Okay. Too bad. Too fucking bad. Calm down. Okay. <laughs> Calm okay. down. Okay. If that's the issue, you're hyper focusing because you know you're wrong you know your on, on all these other issues. Your <laughs> the viewers are tasty for your propaganda. Come on, continue. Are you gonna let me continue? Damn, bro. Calm yes, down. Yes, yes. It's it's your life. Calm Do down. Your life. Calm down. I'm, Jesus. I'm, uh, I'm calm, man. Ham, ham. I'm very calm. I, I, I. Okay, speak. Every deal that is. Uh, joking. Do you want me to skip? You're gonna. Yeah, and if you want to skip uh, me, you can skip me. Then stop interrupting me. You interrupt me also. Oh, if uh, you want to. Okay, I'll, I'll interrupt you, and you're wrong, and you're fucking wrong. So let me continue. Damn. I'm not fucking wrong. Uh, uh oh, what the hell just happened? Uh, yeah, you are. But, um, yeah, you are. So let me tell you why. Let me tell you why. Every deal that uh, Netanyahu proposes to Hamas or Israel proposes to Palestine, I guess, you know, and this goes back to even the Oslo Accords and all of the, the peace deals, right? It's ev everything has been in bad faith. They are not looking for a real solution. They are not looking to give the Palestinians actual freedom. Let me tell you something. Hamas, I know what we're talking about. What are you talking about? The hostage disagreement. The, the what? The, I know, I know, but I'm I'm telling you the, their history behind the agreements with Israel I know is the not. History. Is, I know is, the history. You don't, but it's bad faith. It, then, then, and then if you do know the history, then you you would understand that it's bad faith. The deals that is proposed that, that are proposed by Israel to, to to Palestine or even Hamas. But listen, listen, I'm not done. I'm not done. I'm not done. No, I'm not done. I'm not done. Also, then you are done now. Hamas offered deal uh, offered a deal. To, to Israel, a permanent ceasefire, and then the hostages exchanges, right? A very reasonable deal. And Netanyahu declined it and offered his own, which was in bad faith, not a permanent ceasefire. I don't know how, it was like probably a two-month ceasefire. Now they're talking about like a six-week ceasefire. It is never a permanent one, right? So what is that to our minds? What, well, how do we look at that? If it's a six-week ceasefire, okay, six weeks of, of no bombing, and then the resumed bombing, and more people are going to be killed. Two months, same thing. Six months, doesn't matter. We need a permanent a one. It was never a permanent was, one. No, it was, was not. There was a ceasefire. A permanent one? When when we released, when they released the, our hostages. How long, like, how long was that, and who broke it first? Israel you, broke it. Israel, you, Israel. You broke it first. Israel you broke, broke it. it first. Uh, Jesus, dude. What do you mean? Jeez, you like to your viewers, man. I'm not. You, but that's just what happened. And, and search who, who uh, started sure. to attack. Uh, I mean, it, sure, but I mean, does it doesn't matter with everything else you're saying being completely wrong? I mean, you just don't have a history of saying any facts. You're saying 3,000 were killed on October 7th when it's like less than half of that. But it's not even a numbers game. I don't agree with any innocent killing. I've said that many times. But you're just exaggerating it to make whatever. But listen. 10,000, 10,000, 10,000. 10,000 kids have been killed, yeah. It's not a numbers game. But 10,000 kids have been killed. But it's not a numbers game. Is that what you said? Uh-huh. So, but shouldn't we stop that? I mean, it's like, it's, it's a lot, no? If, this, if it's a lot? Uh-huh. Uh, the people in, in my... In my uh, it's land, not, it's, when, I, when I say it's not here, a numbers game, I... I you know what? Uh, part of them were, were Muslim. I don't know if you know, but they well, killed here. Uh -huh. Here in Israel. Okay, okay, yeah, maybe because the occupation, apartheid, and oppression, right? So, but, but when I say it's not a numbers game, I mean, well, like, when you say 3,000, like, there's no reason to lie. 
You know, because when I say it's not a numbers game, I'm, I'm pointing that to you, to to Israelis uh, inflating their numbers to try to look more innocent, which I'm telling you, it, every innocent life matters. I'm telling you that. Um, so just no yeah, need, to, no, no, no need to exaggerate is what I mean. Um, it just, you, you it just are, doesn't you help anyone. With, you're speaking with Israelis after we had the. A, a second holocaust and you, and you oh asking, my god what you, oh what my god about, second holocaust jesus from christ Ghana? is that serious is jesus that serious? dude jesus dude second holocaust is crazy yes yes it's second holocaust. I, I mean, I mean are holocaust. you are you like blind what's what's ha blind. what's hap what's, what's, what is talking, happening in gaza that. You're 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 not even worth talking to, man. Just skip ask, me. Ask skip me. Skip me. Skip me. Ask your friend from Hamas. They will. They will I, 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 I am. I am Hamas. I'm Abu Monday. I know it. You you should not say it again Jeez, because Jesus, I, I already dude. know that. Jesus, this guy cannot. This guy is not serious. This guy is just this not guy serious. serious. Guys, this guy is very serious. You just want screen you're time. Spreading, you just you you're just want to lies. You're spreading lies. You you, you are the one the spreading truth. lies. You you like I literally said. In the beginning, maybe you are seeking the truth, and I said to myself, if you really is seeking for truth, you will find it, and you didn't find it because you are making your propaganda. Do you support a ceasefire? Do you support a ceasefire? If they release our hostages, that's what a ceasefire is. <laughs> Jesus, no, man. No. You don't even well, if no. even if they release the hostages, hostages, you don't support it. So it's well, not hostages. it's not the hostages. Well, okay. Hostages. Well, most of this, there wasn't a ceasefire. Do you know what a permanent ceasefire is? Yes. Do you support it? If I if I will get all my hostages, yes. That is what a ceasefire is. No. That's a because part of not all my, all I will, my hostages here. Oh my god. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, a ceasefire and you get the hostages. Do you support it? A, a ceasefire and you get the hostages, which is a part of a ceasefire. Do you support that? Yes. You you would stop bombing Gaza if all the hostages were returned permanently because we need we need Sinwar man we 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 must get Sinwar you know so 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 no ceasefire I'm confused you know what the best deal will will be if Sinwar gave up oh so so now 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 because you now you're adding more to the list okay what's no, going no, on man the, <laughs> the, most, the main purpose it's the hostages uh huh really uh huh. But what about yeah. the idea of killing their own hostages? We're just going in loops, bro. I I'm a head off. I'm what a leave, bro. But they don't. Where show me. Yes, they are. Show yes, me. They are. Show me. They are. Show me. They are. Show me. Show me. Show me the facts, baby, that you are uh, published on the uh, on the they're, Instagram. They're all over, man, and I and I could and I would, yes, yes, but I'm streaming right now. But go to Mo Mo Azaiza. Go check his page. Oh, are you are you, are you denying that kids have been killed in Gaza? I'm not denying. Are you denying that kids have been killed in Gaza? Yes or no? I denied that idea. Yes or no? The youth. Yes or no? What? What? What do you mean? Yes. Because you just said they're fake babies. You said they're fake babies. Yes, fake babies. So, are you denying that any kid has been killed in Gaza? You know what? Maybe kids dying, but it's not the responsibility of the IDF. But they're the ones bombing them. Yes, but Hamas is the one using them. But show me. <laughs> show me, bro. Show, show me. me. Show me also. Show me the IDF come to children and aiming them. Show me. They're bombing hospitals and schools and refugee camps. They ask, they ask him very, very uh, polite to leave this area because they're going to bomb it. We never bomb how, how, how? How, how, with, how, with innocent how, people. How do, they, how, how do they let them know? How do they let them know? Yeah. I mean, they are there. So what they go, they, they knock on the school, they knock on the school and they say leave. How do they let them know to leave? How do, how do they let them know to evacuate? They deliver the message by the, the soldiers or whatever. Like like through the phone or something on Twitter or something? No, they go there and say people uh, evacuate this uh, this area. We're going to bomb this uh, this uh, this building. The, the IDF don't, don't goes, know. they knock on the hospital's door and they say leave. We're going to bomb it. They deliver the message. Are you, are with you the, fucking the stupid? Collaboration with uh, one of the, <laughs> one of your uh, people. Yes. Are you stupid? They knock on the door. Hello, we're gonna bomb you. You have twenty four hours. They do that? No, no. So you're telling me that people in Gaza sitting in their home and boom, 
Nobody yes. knows nobody cares. <laughs> oh my God. Yes. So, tell me, tell Not me, everyone me. gets a, a, a leaflet that comes flying down. That's how, by the way. But um, when, the world, and, and, when the world started, when the world start, started, well, well, one of the main ways they told, them, they told them to evacuate this area and go to the south. And they're bombing we, the we, south too. And they're bombing the south. We, they bombing the, the Hamas who uh, uh, sneak in there. <laughs> Why, why, uh, why what, what a there? justification to bomb the safe zones. You know what? You know what? Uh, that's just you like bombing what? hospitals. And, I mean, I have to leave, man. You're just very immature and you don't know how to hold a conversation. I might just have to head oh, out. You know, you are very uh, I mean, I mean you are uh, very you're just like going in loops is, is what you're I mean. Your sourcing is Al Jazeera and all this, this propaganda channel. What do you want What's your to source? Say? The IDF? My source is uh, is uh, is uh, CNN what BBC. CNN? They know the truth. CNN and yeah. BBC are your sources. You you, I, yeah, yeah. you you could have just said um I rather not tell you that would have been like less embarrassing seriously dude. CNN and BBC, yes, haram. Well haram. You watch that? And you get your you news from a, CNN. You, you, watch, enter, enter, you, you get your news. Media. You get your news from CNN. Uh, part of them, yes. And what else? You're using Al Jazeera <laughs> as a source. No, no, right? no, you're shaking. It's okay. Don't shake too much. But but I'm just... Calm. What? You're shaking a little bit. Your hands are like... It's it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. No, it's fine. I'm not shaking. Hamza. I'm just asking about... Can you do this to the camera then? Do that. Do that. Do that. Let me see. Let me see your hand. Put it directly to the camera. No, I'm not going to do a Nazi <laughs> move. Nazi move? <laughs> I'm saying... Yeah. What she did right now, it's a Nazi move. Oh my God, do you see how he twists everything? <laughs> this you is fucking crazy. This is crazy. This is crazy. <laughs> I'm, just crazy you're you're I'm just saying you're shaking. I'm just saying you're shaking because you don't have any sources. That's crazy. What the fuck? Yo, yo, you see how you're twisting shit? You're so immature. You're immature? Uh, more mature than you, I'm yeah. You, I'm you the, the most that I live here. I mean, I think, I think, I think, I would be, I would, I would be, I would also be more mature if I skipped you right now to be the bigger man and end this conversation. So goodbye. Jesus, dude! I said, yo, hold up your hand, and okay, you know what? Hold on. I said, hold up your hand to the camera and see if it's shaking. And um, bro, saying I'm like Nazi. What? Are you kidding? Are you kidding, dude? <laughs> you gotta be, you gotta be joking, man. You gotta be joking. Dude, that's not something to to joke about, bro. You cannot do that. You cannot do that. That's insane. That was one of the the more, I guess, less uh, less. Uh, what am I trying to get? Uh, mature conversations I've ever had from my end as well. You know, I I think because he was just like going in circles, so I was like entertaining it and going with with him. But I shouldn't have. I should have just left immediately. But uh, anyways, I'm still banned on TikTok. They banned me for three days. So unfortunately, mind you, mind you, guys. Please keep this in mind. If I make any jokes in the middle of a conversation. I'm not, I'm not, um, I'm not some debater. I'm not some whatever. I'm not a journalist. I'm not any of that. I'm a YouTuber. I'm a TikToker. I'm an influencer. I'm a creator. So if I make jokes and I'm 20 years old, let me make a joke. Khalas, like leave it be. I see a lot of people in my chat and my comments specifically after a YouTube stream is over. They comment, Hamza is so unprofessional in here. I'm not, my goal is not to be professional. <laughs> My goal is to sh expose the truth, and this is—I mean—and I am. But like, I'm 20 years old. Let me make, let me crack some jokes, Khalas. Like, eh, damn. And they're harmless jokes too. Walla, walla, they are the most harmless jokes. When have I ever made? Like, I, I don't even want to curse. I don't even like cursing. And you think I'm gonna make a, a bad joke? I wouldn't even hurt a fly, bro. Like, come on. Damn. I mean, no, a fly. The flies are pretty annoying, actually. <laughs> Hello.
You look 30? I'm 20, bro. <laughs> 21 and 8 days. March 17th. <laughs> don't skip me. Don't skip me. What's up, man? Where are you from? <laughs> He's from Israel. Okay, well, Hi. Oh, they're Palestinian. Hello? Hi, where are you from? Okay, she's from Israel too. But I have to ask, sometimes they use VPNs, you know? Hello? Oh, I know you. You know me? Oh, what's up, man? Uh, where are you from? Israel. Israel, okay. Where are you from? I'm from Palestine. Palestine? Yeah. Well, the way to the Jehanim. <sighs> God. Astaghfirullah. The guy is uh, crazy. Hello. What's up, mommy? What's up? Where are you from? We from the corn state, Iowa. Iowa. I'm yes, from sir. I'm from Palestine. Yes, sir. How you doing over there, bro? I'm not there right now, but but free Palestine though. Free Palestine, homie. Hey, let's go. Much love, much love, man. Always, bro. You always. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. You take it easy, man. Free Palestine. Yes, you too, bro. You have a good night. You too. You too. Oh, that's cool. Hey, 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 I want to speak to you, man, but don't, don't smokey. No smokey, smokey. What? Nimza avoda zmanit lorecinit vegam nachtom balishka. English? Ulai ga nimza. Eze no selech tiva. Lo mashu amok, mashu matok. Where you? Love for Palestine. Palestine. Imamon de muir. Agibor eshiko. A free Palestine? Free Palestine? Nah, bro. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Hi, where are you from? Hi, where are you from? Nice. Good talk, good talk. <laughs> oh, can you put that away? Oh, he skipped me. Why would they put that away for a random guy in Omegle, right? Hearing things? Oh. Man, there's too much um, going on here. Oh, is that right? Yeah. There's not, a, there's not enough going on here. I know, actually. It's just a, nothing. Yeah. Why you got a watermelon? Free Palestine. Free Palestine. You support? Can you eat that watermelon for me? It's a it's a pillow. What? Okay. All right. Hey hey hey! Hello. Kamza, yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Oh, you're looking hello, for me? My friend. Yeah, actually, yeah, I saw that you're alive, and I looked for you. We talked uh, three days ago in. Uh, when we wasn't around on the drive, felt like we had a good conversation. Oh, okay. Where are you from? I'm from uh, Israel. Oh, okay. I'm from Palestine. Yeah, yeah. I know. Oh, I know. You watch? You watch my videos? Yes, a lot. You're a good one. Really? You like my videos? I have no problem with that. You know, like okay. you're doing good. You're doing good work for your people. Okay. Thank you. You support Free Palestine? 
I support peaceful solution. Do you believe there is like a peaceful solution for this? Um, I, said, I, said, I said it's different. I believe there is no violent solution to this conflict. You, you believe what? There is no violent solution to this conflict. You believe there is no violent solution to this conflict? Yes. To, okay. You know, to the to the Pal to the Israel Palestinian conflict, not okay. only the seven of October. Okay. Do you agree with me? Um. Do I believe there's no no? I mean, in part, somewhat. I I think you know this will not be solved in any violent way. You know. Yeah, I mean, I mean, no... I, I I believe I believe in armed resistance. Okay, but you see that we we have armed resistance for more than uh, one hundred years now, and there is it didn't get um, us to anywhere. Uh, I mean, it's uh, it's been seventy five years since nineteen forty eight. Do you mean like even before nineteen forty eight? I think I. Th I think we can count it from the uh, when the uh, British men that come to, okay. to this region. This, this, okay, yeah, it's been over a hundred years since yeah. then. Yeah. So I mean, what what do you yes. what do you suggest? What's your what's your kind of uh, solution? I guess. Maybe two states, maybe federation of two states. I don't know how it will mm. work, but it must be peaceful. You know. Yeah. At the end of the day, people I, I should mean... not kill each other, and, and nobody should be expelled from his home. No one. Yeah, Nobody yeah, and I, and I wish, anywhere. I wish, and I wish that never happened in the first place with with the, the neck bat. I think we wouldn't even be here if that didn't happen. But I do believe yeah, yeah. in our. I I, I, I agree with you that the displacement uh, of like uh, five hundred villages and like okay, like, yeah, more than seven hundred thousand. Yeah, more than okay. 700, yeah, yeah seven fifty like, thousand. Yeah, you know. Yes, more, you have said. More yeah, than and and, and now the and now the same thing is happening in in Gaza: destruction of homes and people getting internally displaced. Over two million at this point. Um, but yeah. but I wanted to go yeah. back to yeah. I wanted to go back to armed resistance though, because I I do actually believe in armed resistance. I I think you know okay. sure it's been a hundred year or seventy five years I guess if you want to be more technical yeah. since you know um, even even the, the the Jews had armed resistance against the British when it was like uh, the British mandate we have to um to yeah but I, I but but that that's for let's that's, that's like I mean that it wasn't even resistance that wasn't even resistance what? in my opinion what 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 was not resistant the jews when the jews attacked the british uh -huh. in the yeah yeah because yeah because they were getting it i mean the whole point of resistance is that you have to like we have to keep trying i mean with the the british they they were working with the zionists so they were going to get it anyways no, not not really the british worked for the british we must uh, well, accept that the british well, the, had, the, had their interest well, well i the, even heard that the, the yeah sorry yeah. to interrupt but but the british is the british yes i understand that but but they were working towards Zionism, like Zionism. At the beginning, and, and yeah, yeah. At the beginning, uh, only at the beginning of the mandate, maybe the first ten um, years. Then they will, they were slowly shifted away from uh, working with the. Not not really. With the Zionist not, project. Not really. It got it got aggressive. I agree. It got aggressive as as time went on. But Zionism was a major British interest. You know. Uh, but but it it only really got aggressive because, in the forties. Several decades later, not ten years. No, it was it started. Uh, I think 1929. There was a uh, Ar the Arabs attacked uh, some Jewish uh, settlements. Some of uh -huh. them was not uh, even Zionist. In yeah. 1929, I think, when there were the Hebron massacre. Yeah, yeah. That's the... not. That's not uh, with the British though. It was also part of the British, you know. Al Husseini no, didn't no, no, no. The first what I mean is, what I mean is, that's not what we're talking about. Like, that's not the topic. The topic is how okay. Zionism was a major British interest and how they were kind of working towards that. What you're talking about is is not uh, at all this topic. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But 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 okay, Zionism, okay, okay. yeah, yeah. But Zionism in general, <laughs> yeah. Zionism in general started in 1898. You know. Um, 18... and, and, 98 yes, yes. 97. it was started as organized but there was in 1882 
there was started to build land, you know, many... Well, 1882 uh, was the first Aliyah, um, and, and that's when it kind of, I guess, the Zionists, was, Zionists started coming in without a label, I guess, but but it was officially labeled as Zionism, uh, I guess, in, in 19... Um, or 1898. Yeah, yeah, 1898. Yeah, and, and, and 1897, 1899 well, was the first Zionist Congress. Yes, 1898 was the first Congress when they kind of defined Zionism. 1897 is when they signed the papers. 1898 was the first Congress, yeah, yes. When they, when they become, like, organized, the thing but uh -huh. just have like a national aspiration let's call it uh, this way in this in palestine um, historic palestine for, well, for generation well well not not exactly no not not at all actually uh, but before zionism was even invented by herzl it started with the british not even with the jewish people the idea of building a jewish state the idea started with many jewish people that want to come back to to their historical homeland w they choose palestine for with the reason, british you know with the british no it was the ottoman empire back then who when you the british came only after the, the 19th no 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 what, what i mean what i mean is the british began this not really, not really. It was well, something well, that came from the Jewish people. No, no, the British. That no, 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 no. Yes, really, yes, really. The, the the British began the idea of a Jewish state. The the British began that. It wasn't the Ottomans. It wasn't before that. It wasn't. It was the the not, um, not really. the, the British. Te Tel Aviv, the city of Tel Aviv, was established, start to be built in 1909. 1909, yes. 1909. Okay, I'm I'm I'm, I'm talking the, about. I'm talking about 1860s. I'm not even talking about 1909. That that's later on, you know. So what what's your point there? 1860, the British were not a big power in this region. They were like in only in Egypt. They came here only later after they. Well, they no. Well, it, well, that's they, when they planned they, it. Is what I mean. They they were like planning it at that time. So this was even before. So it was not it was not something you know, like uh, serious. The, the the British, like you know, they they well, they worked. They, they gave, well, no, they, it was. It, the, it was. It was. It was. It was actually very serious. The the, the, the British even give uh, no. They give uh, everyone a promise. Like, they given to the Arab a promise that it will be a big uh, Arab state. They give the Jews promise. The British have interest to to have influence in this region. It's not because they like Jews or because they like uh, Arabs. The, well, they want the well, well, I, I, I agree. I, no, I agree. I agree. I, I just think that, like, you know, the British, they, the, the whole point of that, like, and, and Zionism, Zionism, by the way, was their way of doing that. You know what I mean? Um, well, one of the way, it, also giving... Well, well, well also, it, was, it was like the, Arab, it was like the also, main way. Also, it, it was like the also, way. No. Well, yeah. Also Arab, also, Arab nationalism was one of their way. Uh, because uh, um, to, they give promises to the Arab leaders. Uh, yeah, yeah, but but, but Arab nationalism never it didn't go through. It didn't go through. You know, they, like they, that that was a lie. They, that was a lie. Yeah, they, they lied because they instead of giving a state in Syria, they gave it to the French and their Muslim battle and all of this. But um, I. <laughs> I said the British worked for the British. They didn't work for the Jews or for the Arabs. Well, we need to expect to accept yeah, this. Yeah, yes, no, I I agree. But they were working towards Zionism. Is my whole point like that? They were planning it since the 1860s. Like you know, I, Z I, Zionism was a way that the British can establish control. Um, if it's a state that they can uh, that that they create, right? In a in a way, yeah. In a way, yeah. yeah. They believe that the 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 they will uh, give the they will get uh, help from the Jews if they will uh, give them. Yes, that's um, that's true. But it's well, not only they. I, I, okay, no, I, I I agree that um, uh, like okay, for example, like the British, right? They hated yeah. the Jews. You, you, they, they hated the right. Jews, by the way, right? They 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 they. Were they, very they yeah, yeah. They they also yeah, wanted. I even I even, I even write uh, read in an archive that they say. They believe in a lot of uh, mm -hmm. anti-Semite conspiracy yeah, yeah, yeah. against and, the Jews. And the biggest anti-Semites could be the they biggest said, Zionists as well, because they also wanted a Jewish state to kick out all Jews in Europe and solve the Jewish right. problem, right? That was like yeah, their whole way of, they, of... And that's they, what, that's what Zionism want, was, you know? At, at the time, there was a lot of immigration from Eastern Europe. Yeah, the, the European, the European believed that they said, well, you like, need to go where you came from, so we did it. They tell Jewish the, immigration. The, the, yeah, they, they tell the Jews, 
back then that you know the Jews have uh, like the even if that they pray through to Jerusalem and they said next year in Jerusalem and all that they never mm-hmm. take measures to well, 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 come back to their well to their homeland. Well, so this is all proving my point. Zionism was never an organic thing. It was never about the Jewish people. It was about yeah, it, uh, was, it, it, it was it British was, imperialism. It, it, it was in some. It was also in the Jewish people. You know, it's also it was part of the Jewish people. I mean, la- later part. on, later on, but I mean, there was, it was a minority of Jews back then. If you uh, go to history, yes, that's I mean, that, that's minority oh, of Jews believe, believe, okay, no, no, okay. So I'm, I'm talking Israel. about I'm talking about the origins. What you're saying, like that's the lie that becomes the myth. You know, I'm talking about the origins of everything. So if you go, the, the Herzl was start, was start to write about Zionism much before he believed when the, all the nationalism start in Europe, that they also the Jews need their national movement. And uh, unfortunately, and I think, you know, he didn't, uh, he, he, stay, he takes the Arabs in consideration in his book. He said that we will work with the Arabs. Unfortunately, it didn't happen. There was a lot of uh, injustices but, but, being made and mistakes. That's true. Okay, but but, but, but that, that, that was but that was decades after the British was already supporting it. No, no, it was before the British. No, but it was decades anyway. after the British started. Like they were already like supporting it at that point. Uh, like, like for okay, if if you look at at the record, um, you you see the British talking about Jewish state. Before the Jews themselves, 1860s, I, t- I told you earlier, they had plans. Um, they wanted to do it, it, this. It was not. It was not a real plan. It was something terrible. No, no, they, they were real plans. No, they were real plans. I mean, and it, you know, it, it happened too. Uh, so I, I mean, b- because they they wanted the control to control the Middle East and get rid of the Jews. That was their. That's what that, Zionism. That, that's, the, um, that's the only true thing. They want to control the Middle East, and they take. And they did whatever they can to kick out the Ottomans and take this region. And they are, and I think I don't know if you agree with me. That one of the reasons for the for many conflicts we have to these days, the way they handle well, the oh the, yeah the, yeah the, uh, imperialism in general yeah also also, also in, a, I mean, India, I mean, in Pakistan and many places uh-huh. yes they, well, well that that that's that's imperialism. So okay, yeah, that's yeah. true. But you know, yeah. you, but I, there you cannot deny that the Jews also have a historical connection to this land. Oh, I'm I'm not refuting that. I never said they they didn't. Uh, Two thousand years ago, I guess you could say. But but no, but, but it, history it, isn't it, static. You know what I mean? And, and my whole yeah, point, by the way, is that two, Zionism two, is a product two, of imperialism. Two thousand Zionism. I don't think actually. It's maybe it's also helped imperialist powers, but it's. Uh-huh. Also, something that the Jews truly believe in their connection well, to this land. The many Jews believe that they or, will not be safe anywhere. Yeah, yeah, but but history no history state. is static, though. Um, you know, there is a religious connection. I meant static, not not isn't static earlier. My bad. Um, but but there, there it is, is not and, only and, religious, also also by ethnicity. Jews know um, that they are one day well, when the messiah come or whatever they will go back to their homeland well, well time times yeah. change cultures change right like these aren't yeah, the same yeah. people 2000 years ago they weren't even speaking hebrew a- anymore you know that that's true but they start hmm. and times change you know there is palestinian well, exactly community times change Chile. culture change the, the, and there is a palestinian community in chile more than 500,000 people that Build their community before Zionism, and they know their connection to historical Palestine. Even if they're mm. not calling themselves, they don't speak Arabic. They don't uh, have Arabic names anymore, but they know where it, where they from. Uh, well, okay. Well, well, I'm I'm talking about people who have been consistently living there, the Palestinians, right? To, uh, and and just to, to yeah, clarify, but, but two thousand years ago is not a justification. That's my whole point of, of no, bringing the two thousand years ago. Just, okay, not, I not justified it okay. because two hundred years ago. Okay, I justified it because we uh, all. I I don't need two hundred years ago. There is I enough to look at the on the two two hundred years ago, not two thousand. Well, two hundred years ago, Palestinians <laughs> were were thriving. The Palestinians as a national identity started in the end of the 19th century. I don't say it's not a legitimate identity. 
but uh, it um, was mostly like uh, people identified as part of uh, South Syria. Big sure, Syria, sure. Okay, sure. Arab. 19th century, sure. Right. I mean. there, there was a village, there was a strong connection. I tell well, you more than that's the when connection like... to the, the connection to this land is what make you a nation, what defined you as a nation. Sure. I, will not, I, I mean, if you want that. 19th century, sure, that's when like Arab nationalism uh, was the thing, right? But but national identity isn't important because they were living there anyways. There was no need for nationalism yeah, they, they, because they were living there. Yeah, they, 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 were yeah, they had a society, they had a culture, they had a people, you know, and and um, and they yeah, they were that's Palestinians. That, that's one. The, until today, they are like uh, Palestinian. We, even if the with the Nakba and even with all the diaspora, there are Palestinians living in their homeland, thriving in their homeland. Um, I, oh, I, would, I, I would most definitely not say thriving. Palestinians are not thriving. Um, I tell you personally, the, the doctor of the, of our community is Palestinian, like okay, okay, uh, but, Israeli Palestinian. Okay, Israeli okay, Arab, okay, but 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 okay, but is is Gaza thriving? Is the West Bank thriving? No, but okay. Gaza, Gaza is is is, is, is East Jerusalem thriving? If is East Jerusalem, yeah. East Jerusalem is is East Jerusalem thriving? No, that's not, unfortunate. But not, not that's why all. we need a political solution to this day. But it's need to be based also about that the Jews are uh, not colonial well, here. Well, well, I, I mean, Israel is, you know, I don't and, know. and and, and m- m- millions and, and millions millions are living under occupation, you know. But but uh, Zionism, okay, yeah, fine, fine. Was, Zionism is a colonial movement. How about that? Zionism is it like is. a national movement of the Jews. It's well, it's, a, it's a colonial not, movement. Uh, for I, me, it's a national it's a national liberation movement for me. Well, well this is and the language they Jews. used. This is the language they used in the 20th century. They literally used the words "colonize Palestine." That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, they we they need to colonize it again to get national liberation. That's true. It's, it's uh, well, well, no, colonial, no, no. You, I mean, uh, no, no. You, li- like, liberate, liberate are, from who? Not, li- liberate from who? I mean, you can't call it national liberation. From from the empires that control it, but you cannot. We are not like the. Uh, but the indigenous the, people, the, they were. We, li- are not, the, we are not like the European in America and like the European in Australia and New Zealand and uh, in yeah. Africa. Well, yeah, yeah, it it's was very different. Uh, at the beginning, Very I mean, different. it was no, no, not not exactly. It it, it was not different. It was not the, different. I mean, in the in the beginning, yeah, it was. There there was a Jews that came here from Iraq, from Morocco, from Yemen before the state of Israel, and they have really uh-huh. a connect uh-huh. connection to this place. Still not the Palestine. What? It's still not Palestine though. Like like Iraq is not Palestine. Yemen is not Palestine. They were like also the many Palestinians. You know, this was there was no border like today. People came in and out all the time. I know that the Arab community in Arab are mostly from the 19th uh, century, from the mid 19th century. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But there was I a there, there was a consistent presence. You're, you're talking about a minority. Yeah, the Jews were a minority here for for a long time. Um, That's true. Okay, <laughs> that that I mean the majority of, of of um the majority have been living there for generations hundreds of, of years and i'm ta- i'm, ta- I'm talking way, about i'm talking about palestinians not not the it, not jewish people by the way in by the way in the in jerusalem there was like uh, the the jews always had the consistent uh, present in jerusalem in uh, even other cities even in uh, hebron uh, el khalil there was like a consistent present of Jews in these places before Zionism. I mean, I'm, I'm not, once again, uh, denying that. I'm not refuting that there is Jewish history in, in, okay, you know, on the land. So I'm not, I'm not denying that. But, but one, uh, I guess, uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, it's, it's, it's not a, a lie. But there's, mostly, not, there's Muslim history too. There's, um, I guess, true. the, the, the Muslim, Greeks, the, the Greeks, the, I guess, there, there are... The, um, yeah, the, you know, the Muslims have history. They, they build the city of uh, Ramle. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, okay, but, but, but my whole point... Okay, so there, there's, Muslim, there's Muslim history too, right? So should Pakistanis yeah, come but, live in Palestine? Uh, but, you know... Should, should Pakistanis uh, our, come live in Palestine? Should Pakistani? No, it's because they, they are by religion. I saw also by ethnic, ethnicity connection. 
And there and also the different I want to mention. Well, well okay, um, okay. Let me ask you a question. Um if an Arab Jewish person is living in Palestine, right? How can that justify a, a Jewish person coming, uh, I don't know, a person from, from Poland, I guess, coming? It's happened already. It's yes. Happened. It's the, the, I understand. The Palestine, the, but the, how, the, how can that it justify was, it, was, it? It's not justifiable, it was, though. Before 48, just buy here lands, you know? The Tel Aviv okay, and all okay, the okay. major cities before 48 was <laughs> built on land that being bought okay. by Arabs. Okay. Do, you, do you know what those groups were called? Do you, do you know what those groups were called? The ones that uh, that bought land? How they were called? Palestine Jewish Colonization Association. Yeah, exactly. Literally, literally. Okay, maybe in English. I mean, I, I mean that, that is one of the that's one of the bigger ones, um, and that's what it is called. There was like uh, there were like uh, many. Uh, Palestine, uh, the organization. That was the early one, the one you said. I think there was. No, that, like, that's uh, one of the. I mean, that's a that's a big one. I, I, but but they they used my whole point is they used the the language colonize, <laughs> like like literally it's in the name colonize. Yeah, but you look at it in an anachronistic way. You know, this was like uh, I mean, I mean, done in the uh, back then. What well, it, it was normal to colonize. Back. Back then, it was that was that what I mean, happened it's, it's in America. What, what, what is ago, America man. if not a okay. colonial project? The what? What is the United States if not a uh, colonial project? Uh, the origins is a colonial movement, or, or the U.S. Uh, as a colonial project? Yeah, I mean it is. I mean we admit that. I'm not saying it's not. <laughs> yeah, and unlike the Jews, they really I make mean, it, a genocide it's, there. It's literally called the U.S. colonies, so. I yeah, mean, yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. So yeah, the, the the Jews had to colonize their historical uh, homeland to get national liberation. Let's have it this way. No, are you are you serious? I mean, that's just not uh, that's like that's no offense, but I mean that's stupid. That's a myth. That's what we believe. It's our well, well, narrative. Well, you know? well, I mean the way you describe, um, you know, I mean that that's just a myth, though. It, it's it's romanticized. You're you're romanticizing the, you know, colonization. I mean, it's it's a myth. What you're saying? You know? it, it was out. It was about imperialism and colonization, violent colonization. It's only after '48 it's become like you know the Nakba and all this. Before this, Arabs sold land to Jews. You know, I mean, it's so well, well. Once again, sold... once again, the names of these groups had literal colonization in the names. You know, and absentee Arabs, no, by the way, and Ottomans. No, no, <laughs> not, not it wasn't them, just. You cannot... So your your problem is with capitalism, not with like you know why the Arabs sold land from the first place. The, well, that's all happened. No, you no, know, I, mean, I. No, I. I mean they. they, they, they... they... I mean, yeah, cl class has a has a big part, you know, but um... and I like you know, the, the, I don't say that the Jews are the, the Zionist movement is the perfect uh, moral movement of all times, but it was necessary back. Not then. Not necessary at all. I mean, there's I, no, it just wasn't. Like once again, it, it, that's a myth. I guess. Yeah, I guess we, that you you are taught. We, I mean, that's we, that's we it's, are, it's, it's not necessary at all. Just, just, Jews in Russia had basically one opportunity. Well, well, let me ask you this. Well, let me ask you this. Before 1948, were Jewish people living on the land? Before, yes, of course. Okay, so like you said, it's uh, Jews were living there. They were already living there. Arab Jews. It was not necessary to colonize they were not, Palestine. Uh, they, they were they living there. They were already living there. They were not. They were not identified as Arab. They were identified as Jews. No, they, 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 they were. No, no. No, they they were Arab Jews. They spoke Arabic, Arabi. They spoke Arabic. They spoke to Arabic, yes, that's true, but they were not identified uh -huh. as an Arab as part of well, the okay, Arab. Okay, okay, uh, okay. Well, first of all, nobody identified as, as an Arab. It was the British who called us Arabs, but okay. you know, they you know, we identified by religion. Anyway, but they were Arab and, Jews before 1948. Anyway, I, I want Hamza. They spoke friend, Arabic. I want to say, I want to say something. Like we cannot. Uh, it's different topic. We cannot fix any injustice being made in the past. But we can make work together to make sure there will be no more injustices in the in the future. You know that the Arab, the Jews that live in Arab countries that were 
didn't care less about Zionism or forced to kick out from those land. So you know, we cannot. I mean, yeah, that. that, that's terrible. Oh, yeah. It's, I mean, okay. And, and it, and it was the, and it was because of Zionism at the end of the day. Also, no, the parhud in Iraq in 1941 was because of racism of Haj Amin al Husseini that inside uh, the people that. Well, well, who put him in in power? I think it was the British. <laughs> exactly right. So I mean, I mean, ex that's exactly my <laughs> but, point, right? But 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 it, at the but end of the day. At the end of the day, this is all about Zionism, and Zionism, Zionism was was the is the key factor in all of this, right? I mean, the, the so bombings, as, uh, the bombings. I want to say that we can, we cannot fix any injustices being made by the name of Zionism in the past, but you know we can make sure that there will be better future. But it requires both sides to compromise about something. Ah, uh, well, well, well. Listen, listen. The, the the bombings um were were committed by zionists before 1948 right yeah. uh, i mean do you know do you know uh, avi avislam avislam yeah it's very controversial one you know i'm sure very, well i'm sure he, i'm sure he's a, he's a, he's extreme leftist you know i don't okay, but, uh, but but basically i don't i don't look from for from you know i don't take controversial uh, a mindset in the Arab world to uh -huh. uh, to uh -huh. justify things, you know, because there is like I can bring you like mm -hmm. a Mustab uh, something. There yeah. are also okay, Arab well, my, my 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 whole point. Uh, uh, Avi Shlam, he he's an Israeli historian, and his family is Iraqi Jews, right? And and he he writes yeah, he he writes about the Jewish society in Iraq. They were Arab. They spoke the language. They worked and they lived there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yeah, in Iraq, I, in Iraq, most of the communities in Baghdad, especially my uh -huh. uh, my background is not from Baghdad; it's from the other place in Iraq mm -hmm. that have different languages. But yes, yeah, and, and well, uh, okay, well, yeah. Uh, let me continue. So I I I agree with you that uh, there is the, it's uh, the British and nationalism involved in the what happened in Iraq that. Mm, the delete the Jewish community. Mm -hmm. That's uh, there's two things. It's not only the, the, the world of oh, feeling well. of nationalism. Okay. The 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 Arab it was Said al Nuri back then that uh, persecuted first the leftists and then he said after we finish with the leftists we will get rid from the Jews. Back then. Mm -hmm. well, but I, it I, happened, know. you know. Yeah, I I, I don't know. But, uh, uh, all about many, that, many, I guess. But, many, but, 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 many oh, oh, I, tell, I give, I give, I give you more. Many Iraqi Jews wouldn't come to Palestine, to Israel, Palestine, call it what a Canaan, if not, uh, they were not falsely leave their uh, country. They were, they were like, they like their uh, Iraqi identity. Mm -hmm. But that's happened. Um, well, well, okay. Let, let me continue. The 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 bombings uh, that that started in Iraq. I'm, I'm going to continue about Iraq and, and the historian. Um, the, the bombings that started in Iraq led to the displacement of the Jews from Iraq, uh, right? I know this. It was committed by Zionists, right? But, but I, know, I, know the, I know this argument about a false flag operation to uh, bring fear, but it's not really 100% true. There was a lot of uh, hatred from the government against Jews. Well, that, well, uh, what, that, what I'm what I'm trying to say is that Z Zionists saw that the Arab Jews, like you said, they didn't care about Zionism, right? So this was a way to force them to come to Israel, to force Zionism on them. That's what I'm trying to get at. Also, with the help of the racism and nationalism that was uh, starting in the Arab world back then. You know, I I well, don't well, say well, 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 because of the because of the British divide and conquer. I mean, that's like. The whole thing, and because of Zionism. Also, you know, it's also because of the British, but it's also because of the rise of nationalism. No, I'm. I think it's it's mainly to do with the British and and Zionism, specifically Zionism, in my opinion. Yeah. I, I think not in my opinion. I think that's just like historical facts. But but this so, yeah, this but, was a know, mode. That, that, th this was yeah, a mode. This was a mode of dividing us, like like Iraqi nationalism, for example, um, was starting. Right and by and large, the the Jews in Iraq li uh, liked it. Um, they wanted to be Iraqi and build Iraq. 
Um, yeah, that's so. Man, yeah, so so so. I mean, but that was a threat to the Zionists. So uh, I mean, who wanted to make a Jewish state? Yeah, but 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 uh, you cannot say that Saeed Al Nuri, the Prime Minister of Iraq, or he was the president. I don't know. He's he was a Zionist. He wasn't. He was a racist uh, Arab nationalist. And uh, uh. there is also there is a a big a very there was historical speech of a of a Jewish uh, Arab uh, Iraqi Jewish. Uh, in the parliament of Iraq, that he was uh, Ezra, something very important uh, speech. If you will uh, read it, I, uh, I don't remember his name, but it was like a right, right. I mean, I mean, listen, listen, had, listen, listen, uh, uh, listen well, my, 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 my whole, my whole point, my whole point is that this all boils down to Zionism. Again, all of what you're talking about, this comes after Zionism. So if there were no Zionism, there would probably be not, not any of that, right? Yeah, um, I mean, yeah, we have to talk about the, happened, the or origins of, of a, Iraq, lot of, you know, a lot of this. It's, it's happened in Iraq. Uh, yeah. It didn't happen in here. It, yeah, all yeah. Of the, Zionism all, you cannot say, is still the all, reason. It's like Zionism is the satanic movement that is... Uh, be, that make all the uh, uh, terrible things in the world. I mean, that's how the Arabs saw it. They saw it as, uh, I mean, which, I which agree, it is. I, I think it's a. I, I think it's a I virus. Am. I think Zionism is a virus that there that spreads so fast. I mean, it, it was a threat to there, na to Arab nationalism, Zionism. There, there is a lot of uh, definition for Zionism, but yes, the Arabs saw it as a threat. They, uh -huh. uh, there was a lot of misconception, uh -huh. but, but, but it all happened. Well, we are now in 2024. Well, well, okay, yeah, it all happened. That doesn't mean it's okay. A Arab, by the way, when I say Arab, I mean, um, sorry, what the hell was that? When I say Arab, I mean Arab Muslims, Christians, and Jews, by the way. I'm not talking about one specific religion. Um, and, and they saw Zionism as an extension of, of European uh, imperialism. Um, they saw Zionists as the same as the British. Okay, but it's like now it's history, you know, that the satanic Zionists you imagine are not exist anymore. No, it's still happening today. I mean, colonization, imperialism, that's like the whole I mean, that's what uh Zionism is at the end of the day and and, and that's still happening today. Now, I guess instead of Zionists uh, and and UK, um it is Israel and the US, you know? But it's and like the it's the same thing. Uh, the, I think that the U.S. is really is against the settlers uh, in the in the West Bank. Yeah. So it's um, not about. Uh, well, they're funding the genocide the that's happening in in Gaza right now. So I mean, I don't know. There is a U.S. Uh, there is a U.S. Uh, they they, they may they, they may be against settlers, but they are still imperialist. They want to control the Middle East. They want to have power in the Middle East. They want to control it, basically. Power. I mean, yeah. But yeah, it's the same with Iran. They that I want to have a imperialist uh, aspiration in this region. Well, well, well. No, what I mean and is like are... Israel. Israel is is a is a means for that, I guess. Um, and and that's that's how yeah. Arab. That's how the Arab you know, world sees I'll... Israel. They see Israel as an extension of the U.S. So that, that that's uh, really unfortunate. I don't I don't want to say it this way. I say tell you by the majority of the Jews that if they will believe in a sustainable peace with their neighbors, they will make a big compromises for this. No, um, well, but what peace? What peace? It, it's 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 um. It can be a lot of ways. It can be two state to uh, a feder. Uh, 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 one state with different cantons, the federation of two states, the political solution can look in many ways. But what I want to say in the end of the day, it needs to give to both sides equality. And yeah, like, yeah, but but I mean, like what peace though? The, it's, the, it's it's capitulation, you know. Uh, and the, I, I, I agree. Uh, I agree that that political solution is possible, but it has to be just. Uh, and my whole point, by the way, about um, I guess that, how, how the Arab world sees say, Israel. Hold on, but my, my whole point, I, I was like finishing and I, I you went and you said something, um, which is fine, but I, I, I wanted to finish it. How the Arab world sees Israel, 
so so if you hate the u.s and you hate imperialism then you I, also I don't hate i don't I well well no not you not war. you not you if anyone hates the u.s and hates imperialism and it's i know it's a hard word or a tough word but i mean we we have i hate the u.s if you hate the u.s and you hate imperialism then you also hate don't, israel don't here, no, you can... okay uh i said this this way i want to see my Arab neighbors living with peace with me. I know the Palestinians that live with me that they are very peaceful people that want the, to live in dignity and I want to see them uh, live in equal. I don't want to see them discriminate or anything like this. I'm telling it from the bottom of my heart. I want to live that we could live here like in a peaceful, respectful. There will be never like a complete justice. There will be need to be a compromise, you know, but um, I, I mean, I, I also want to live in, in peace and, and not have, you know, an, you know equal I, I want to have equal rights. I want to have equal rights uh, okay. as everyone else. Uh, you, I do too. You, I'm not, you I know, I'm not you, saying that. You, uh, deserve, you, you deserve to have equal rights uh -huh. in, your, in your historical yeah. Uh, homeland. Yeah, but, but I, what I mean, I what I mean is that, that. Like, but, but I mean, of course, who, who wouldn't want equal rights and, or, or want that for, for people? I understand. I mean, Zionists, but I understand that there has no, been. They're, they're, they're but, okay, listen, listen, Zionists, listen. Like but I mean, like it, it is. A it's, it's, it's a virus. It is. It is. It is. But 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 th th there has like never a, been. Like it, yeah. Well, like it's a dragon with Golda Meir, Moshe Dayan, and Sharon Head that's burning villages all around. I mean, I mean, Zionism no. is is is. Uh, I mean, it is as bad as as I'm making it sound and as it seems. It is. I mean, it just is. If, if there was no Zionism, there would be no uh, massacres that you were talking about even before 1948. There would be no October 7th. There would be none of all of this if Zionism didn't exist. We, we, Unfortunately, we, that's just how no, it is. But, but we, hold on. The, the, hold on, hold on. I, I really want to say something. I really, I, really wanted to, I really wanted to say something. There has never been a, a just peace offered to the Palestinians. It, it wasn't even compromise. It was unjust, for example. I, 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 I think that uh, Yitzhak Rabin back then really wanted to compromise and also Barak, Ehud Barak that I, I don't like his uh, approach but if do not the uh, the intifada was he probably had uh, someone like him that will continue they want to just peace he totally respect the Palestinians Ehud Barak he had the law I, he I, said he, I mean, he I, mean I mean at the at the end of the even, at the end of the day all of these leaders Israel first Israel is going to be first and and Palestinians there there there's always going to be some sort of um you know I, I don't know apartheid oppression occupation with the Palestinian no, people no, I'm not no, I'm no, not no, sure no. nothing none of that went through that's that, like that that's all hypothetical no, none, none of that happened none no. of that nothing, nothing went through with that but but let me just let me just tell you for, for example right none of the peace plans that have been offered to the Palestinian people, peace plans, quote unquote, by the way, ha had a right of return. I mean, any Jewish person from anywhere in the world can come live in Israel slash Palestine. Meanwhile, a woman who was born in Haifa and displaced in 1948 cannot return. Do you see how that's wrong? You know, the right of return can be only as uh, something symbolic. They can get, you know, they can get some... Uh... Something back, but you know, you, you understand that Israel will never give like uh, millions of Palestinians come back live in. Do you see how that's Israel. wrong? Do you see how that's wrong? I see how you see it wrong, but they can have a better. But if you were Palestinian, you would see it as wrong as I am. But why? Why do you not see it just as wrong? I mean, right of return for the Palestinian people that were displaced from their homes in 1940. Can they not go back to their homeland? You mean also for their dissenters? And yes, their, uh, yes, of course. It's, of course. It's millions of people. It's yes. The do, do it now before it becomes tens of millions. <laughs> right? Uh, but it will change all the it will change the old country. How can we, you uh, think Israel could I mean, accept what would it what, change what exactly? Why would it change? Can you tell me? How it change? Change all the society. Also, some of them have, don't have a peaceful aspiration. So, so are Jewish I people said, better? Are Jewish people better than than Palestinians? No, we are not better, that, my friend. But they well, that's the what it's, that's what it's sounding could, like. The, the Palestinian could have the right of return as a, something symbolic to the, what becomes the state of Israel. Well, well and uh, they well, could uh, have the right of I, return I, to historical Palestine. Well, I think I think so the whole to, the whole to point the West Bank and Gaza. Uh, well, well, the whole point. Of of uh, why people like you are maybe maybe have these this the you know don't want the Palestinian people 
to to come back the right of return is because you want to keep them a minority that is the unfortunate truth because you want it to uh, continue uh, to be a jewish state is is that why in a way yes man it okay well, well do, do, do you not see do you not see how that's a problem uh, you know, it's as I said, we cannot make a justice for all, you know, uh, for like a, the, the, the complete and total justice. There will be some compromise. Well, 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 well complete and total justice for the Palestinian people and, and all the wrongdoings that I have know, happened the to right, them the right is of, the right of return. Right I think that's people. a big one. I think the right of return is a big one. That, that, I know, that... I know. It's, uh, I know how it's important to you in your narrative. Not my narrative. I, I think that's just, I think that's uh, the right thing to do. I, I think... I think that that should happen. That they were displaced from their homes in 1948. They, they I mean, I mean, right to return to the future Palestinian state, and they could have something. Symbolic. Well, 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 no, no, no. to to their if homes Israel that they not, were to their it, homes that they were kicked out of in 1948. That not not to a land that's called Palestine. I'm talking about to their homeland. But but some okay. Of the, some of those homes are not exist anymore. But but okay. But but I don't I don't I don't want a two state solution. I, I want a one state. So you know, that's what, you know, one state. I mean, like, I mean, you know, look, okay, listen, listen. For, forget about right of return for a second. I support a one state solution. And, and that also will never happen but because what, Israel cares about the demographics, no, it, right? It, I mean, I mean, no, I, I hope it say, does. Uh, I think it's more realistic be, than a two state solution because of all the peace treaties and all peace deals, whatever. But listen, like they, a, they, what will be the symbols on the name of that future state? It doesn't matter as long as we have, I, I don't care personally, as long as we have equal rights and we can live there in peace with no occupation, oppression, humiliation, and, and apartheid of the Palestinian people. Equal rights but, as citizens, equal votes, I think that's okay. I don't care what the name is, right? Um, but but Israel, on the other hand, they do care. They do care about, about the demographics. They want a Jewish majority. And, and if they give everyone in the West Bank and Gaza equal rights as citizens... Then it threatens the idea of a Jewish state. Do you understand the, that? I tell you, the, the, the Jews care only about the national security. It's uh, there. We are mostly driven by fear of being thrown to the sea, like many Arab leaders say, that they would throw us to the I, sea. I, I mean, then why are why are there settlements in the West Bank? I don't I don't agree with this. Okay. I can tell you not with the not if that's like a. Only if you want to, want, if the Jews really want to one state with equal rights. But if it will, will lead to apartheid state, I really don't agree with this. I mean, do, do you agree? Do you agree the West Bank is a military occupied zone? There is a people. Okay, so under military cool, occupation. cool. So, 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 yeah. please, so please don't say that Israel yeah, cares it's, about it's, security it's, because seven hundred thousand well, Israelis, they don't care, right? They, they don't they, care they about security. They, the Israelis, when they go to vote, the average Israelis that live inside Israel, not the West Bank, the you know, the average Israeli, let's say, care about uh, care about national security, uh, uh, about not being threatened, uh, about not being killed. That's the only okay. thing that. Okay. Okay. Well, well, I'm I'm I I don't know about that, but I'm speaking about the the government, the Israel, the people that have control over what actually happens. Um, seven hundred thousand Israelis are living. In a military occupied zone, meaning Israel does yeah, not the care the about security. Of them are really near to the, the majority of them are really near to the border. I think there is only. But okay, but but is that not dangerous? Is that not dangerous for them? They they decide they want to live there. You know. I mean, yeah, the, I, it's, I, I, I but you but you you to just told me you don't agree with it though. I don't agree, but you know, if some Israeli want to go there and uh, live there, I cannot uh, tell them what to do. I will not go to live in a place that my neighbor is not equal to me. It's well, not how I. It's not how I want to see the society. I don't like to see like okay, okay. Uh, higher and lesser people. Okay, if but but my, my I mean. okay, but my point is that Israel does not care. They don't care about security. It's another myth. Israel really care about security. The Israelis population. Really, well, the what drive us? You need to understand it also for your viewers that our secu our you know how how we see it. The security is the most important thing. That's why okay, we have okay. Okay, I, I I mean, listen. I don't know. Maybe you do. Maybe people do. But I'm talking about the state of of Israel. They care about imperialism and supremacy. Them caring about security as a government, as a country, not as a it's country. Not really, it, it's a myth. The, because we vote for the for the Knesset and the for the parliament and the parliament make the government. So the policy most of the time is what the you need to 
you need to not see exactly to not exactly i mean the uh, the IDF and uh, I guess the government is very corrupt. Maybe, okay, but but you're contradicting yourself in like, that case. Maybe sometimes they lie to the people, but if you guys you, you will build a if you will build a conversation with the Israeli people, what I think needs to be happened. Okay, okay, but but in my opinion, in my opinion, okay, would you would you would you say that most people in Israel don't like the settlements? Yes. Okay, then you're contradicting yourself. If you're saying that the people have a vote and then a say, why why do settlements exist? They've existed for fifty six years. If you're saying that the pal that the, the Israeli people, the, right? I mean, settlers, so because the settlers know how to promote their agenda in the okay, so, Israeli political system. Okay, okay, so but it's not because we like it. Uh, many believe it's terrible. You know that's why we left Gaza. That's why. In 2006 and or seven, there was like uh, uh, going out also from the majority of the West Bank. There was like this idea back then. Unfortunately, it didn't happen. So the majority of Israel don't want to see the remote settlers. Yeah, that, uh, 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 Almert, the Almert. Yes, yeah, you know, he's, you know, very good. Mm -hmm. he, he 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 was chosen. He was chosen in 2006. Mm -hmm. He was by the by then he win uh, he was have he win Netanyahu Netanyahu was very, really small uh, uh, have very small amount of votes but uh, back then he wanted to if the peace process will not succeed to withdraw from the majority of the West Bank because it's destroying us uh, the, that was the uh, sentiment back then but since then you know, how like many years of Netanyahu that lie all the time, but that's another topic. Um, yeah, I mean, I sort of believe that, that Almert wanted peace, you know, in some way, okay. he, he, in some way. He want, he, he, want, he wanted, and, and someone like Almert can be a prime minister again. You need to understand that if the Israelis will believe... I mean, I don't... I, Palestine... I hope. I, I, I mean... <laughs> You know, we, we uh, Netanyahu has been in power for 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 two. I think I think Bibi radicalized an entire generation of Israelis, so it's going to be pretty hard to find yeah, someone like Olmert yeah, wanting many peace. People in, many people in Israel hate him from the bottom of the for know, different reasons. For different reasons, not because there's ma a genocide. Many, but... many, of the, many, many of the reasons that he's being hated, not only because he's corrupted, it's just an excuse. It's because where the way where he lead the country, because he don't want to solve the fundamental problem of this country. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, of his yeah, I mean, um, I don't know. I, he, I I think that. He, but you know, you you are you I mean, as he, a Palestinian. You are the proud Palestinian. Mm -hmm. If more Palestinians with like you will come and build a conversation with the Israeli society. Mm -hmm. things can be changed you know but i mean end, I, I, we... I mean there are there are conversations like this you know of course there are no, I, no there are few, one though. one there but there are there are I, I i think i think we can agree there are and the negotiations in 2007 and 8 but um i, I think i think i mean did, did you know hamas supported that by the way the negotiations in in, in 07 and, and 8 as part of the big plan, you know, I don't um, believe Hamas really believe, uh, see the Jews as equals to Muslims. I mean, no, but they literally uh, said they will accept them. I don't know what what plan you're talking about. I don't think there there was or is a big plan like that. But e even if they don't agree with the negotiations, you know, Hamas has oh, they they said they said that in 2008, right? So. Um, yeah, I mean, I mean, at the end of the day, man, with Netanyahu, I, I, I feel like there will always be someone like him in power. Always, I think it's going to be well, hard to find someone like Almert or anyone that wants true justice and and, and peace. We we had yeah, we know. had all we had Olmert, we had Barak, we had Rabin. Yeah, yeah. What I mean That's is like okay. now, like at this point, moving forward, I don't think we're going to find someone like Almert um in in, in power. Gantz, Gantz. Is the now is the is have like a, a very big potential to become prime minister in their future. Bibi will not live I forever, mean, and Bibi is Bibi is in power for so many years because he's a 
smart politician, not because his uh, people believe in his agenda or the Israeli societies like Benjamin Netanyahu, not at all. He's a smart um, politician. He know how to manipulate everyone who, who, against each wait, other. Wait, wait, wait. Who exactly did you say was going to be prime minister? Maybe Benny Gantz. I don't know. Benjamin uh -huh. Gantz. Benny Gantz. His name is Benny. Uh -huh. Most of the. Uh -huh. Benjamin, uh -huh. but the nickname is Benny. Yeah, I mean, I mean, he. he can be, uh, but but he's not. Is he, the thing, right? Maybe he will. I don't know. But but in in my opinion, from I mean, not in my opinion. I think just the way it's going. You, we're not going to find someone, um, you know, I be, that's I believe, different you know, than that, Netanyahu, to be honest. What, what, what happened in the last uh, six months, last five months, is that pay, people need to understand that the current situation is not sustainable and we need to find a better solution, you know, even mm. if it will be um, a long process. Also in the Israeli society. Yeah, I mean, I, understand. I mean, yeah, we, we obviously there, there needs to be a better solution. To what's going on i just think if israel continues to offer unjust and 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 bad faith proposals then there's not going to be uh, a solution you know pa palestinians are oh. open to negotiations we've always been open to negotiations uh, the fact that the, the negotiations are always just in bad faith towards the palestinian people is, is is why none of them have have gone through you know um and, and I mean, there, there's always something missing from it, you know, w whether the acknowledgement of settlements and, and, and it being removed is not in there or or maybe, you know, their own military, uh, yeah, their own military, their, their own airspace, their own currency, something is always missing to make it an official state, you know, um, for a two-state solution, the, I guess. But so Palestinians yeah, are open in, to that. In the, in, the long, in the long process, I believe they can get everything except the military. Because that will make us very fair. Well, well, I, uh, well. So, okay, then, then, would you agree no military for Israel as well? No, because we are. Well, not okay, exactly. So, so, so that's that's not equality at all. I mean, we we need our military as well. You, what about us? What about our security and our safety? I think that's very. Who will attack? Um, if, if you have if you have peace with Israel, who will attack you? We have a bigger threats. We have like extremists in Lebanon. The I mean, anyone, a, anyone, time. any anyone can can attack us. You know, uh, you maybe Jordan who, will attack us. I don't know. Who knows? It, it it's not um. <laughs> Yeah, there uh, are there are uh, other the, countries the, in this world that don't like I, Palestine. I, I think there is there is more there is more chance that the the Palestinians will take Jordan than Jordan will take. Okay, but you get my point. But, you get my point. It's not just Israel that's going to be um but, you know but, you know, uh, like you know whatever. But the, no no but, 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 but we need we need security. We we, we deserve it. We we need security and we deserve it. I, you, okay, so you, so you need to have security but you That's a, we need military. That's the that's security. I mean, we need a security like that. But you know that if we have peace with Israel, no one will attack you. We know, like we have peace with Egypt, and we, they cannot bring the most of the military to the Sinai Peninsula. No, I mean that's sovereign state. It's part of the peace deal with Egypt. So, so as I said, the, as I said, who, you, you who, who knows? We, we are afraid. If you have a country, okay, but are, are we not afraid though? Are we not afraid? Do we not need a security or a security? Do we do we not need military? Do we not need you, control you over the, airspace? A state like any other state, right? You, airspace, I I agree with. You need to have everything connection between the West Bank and Gaza, uh, free airspace. That's all something solvable. But having a military, something that you know. You understand why Israel is feel uncomfortable with that? Do you understand why Palestinians are, are uncomfortable with the IDF and the Israeli okay, military okay, and how you, corrupt they are? I mean, listen, if the you, Palestine you, you conflict, can... listen, listen, if the Palestine conflict uh, is solved, then there will be peace in the entire Levant. Because all of these conflicts with Lebanon, Syria, Egypt, Jordan boils down yeah, to the probably... Palestinian issue. So... They're, giving they're the, Palestine, the Palestinian, giving the Palestinian people an actual state, either in a two-state solution or a one-state solution, where we all have, um, you know, equal rights. Or, but if we're going to the two-state solution, it has to be a state like any other state. If that were to happen, the, the, there would be peace in the entire Levant, because at the end of the inshallah. day, inshallah. <laughs> I mean, Inshallah. I, but 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 that's what I mean is we need security. We need our own currency. We need our own airspace control. We need all of that, uh, all of that, like any well, other I, state. And I, if, if, if that were if we were to be completely I, equal as any other state and, and be, uh, I, you know, wor working I'm like any other state, be, then I'm there would be peace in the Levant. Those country will the, the countries in the Levant will have no reason to fight. 
probably is. I mean, so, that, I mean, that's it, true. I mean, it is. That's like yeah, that's yeah. Prob probably okay. true. That's probably true. But uh -huh. uh, many countries use the Palestinians just as excuse to promote their agenda. You so, know. So my whole point but, is uh, that. So my whole point is that they if, will if, have if, no. They will have no excuse if we'll have a real peace between me and you. Okay. I am not in the position to negotiate because I'm not being elected, but I said to you as an uh, average uh, Israeli that uh, having like a military, full military, is something that Israel will hardly, uh, will not live quiet with it. But you can... Uh, I mean, but but do you a... see how that's the problem though? I mean, you're, you're, making, you're, you're making Palestinians it's... second. When it should be equal, not, it should be equal. Like you know, you guys don't need. Military, and I'm not. Like, and I'm not saying it, Palestinians but, first, but equal, same level. No. Okay, I want to. I want to have equal, but I don't uh, think you need military the way we need. Military. Well, then it's not equal. Well, then it's not equal at the beginning. Yes, but it's only about well, military, my friend. Well, it's not only if about, it's about security. It's about the security for the Palestinian people. I mean, you know, I mean, we deserve probably, it. Probably. You know, and, 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 probably and, 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 and probably, uh, probably in the long term, if there will be a real peace and real connection between the people uh -huh. and there will be, the, the Israeli also will not need the, such a big, uh, strong military. Okay. Thing. Yeah. But, but the, my if whole point is that we need a, sec a security if, just if, like if, any if, other if, normal if state. The, if, we need it right now, by the way, more than Israel. Gaza needs security right now. Well, they say that uh, they, they, they have uh, Hamas. Have, That's, come on. Be serious, the, though. That's not, um, you know. Hamas had an uh, army. You know, you, you want uh, tanks and uh, jet fighters. I mean, we, we need, like, actual security or an iron dome you know give us an iron dome okay maybe i i iron dome yeah, give, give us defenses you know, the, you know? Uh, give us the call up us the, tell them to fund us the, the, the defense is on the house you know but uh offensive military <laughs> it's like too much you, um, know, you understand but you understand that if there will be a peaceful generation or two people will not care the problem is the israeli military will not be strong as it is today if there will be a generation of peace like what happened in europe between uh, uh, um, germany and france you know there is a lot of historical bad blood between uh, germany and its neighbors and i mean you know and I, they, I, I, I mean listen at the end of the day for for a true solution a true I guess if you want to go the two-state route, um, you know, it, 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 a, a real it, state. But but listen, if it will be, if even if it will be a federation of, of uh, uh -huh. like, but but listen, listen, one listen. State, two state, you know, you under you understand, my mm -hmm. friend, that one state can't work at the beginning because there is. Well, 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 I, well, no, okay, a, well, no, I, 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 I think it can. That have a war for more than hundred years. We cannot agree about the flags. Probably that will be for this. Okay, one okay, state. but listen, but listen, listen, listen. A one-state solution right now. I listen. I understand it's going to be hard, and it's going to take steps to get there. I understand that. Um, but but I, I but it, it but I, it, it I, is I, way I, more. I, it it way, is way more it possible was... and and realistic than a two-state solution with all of the treaties and peace uh, uh, things that we've b if, we've if been offered. Will, if it will be if it will be two states. There are not necessarily have to be like uh, borders that is closed and the wall and the fences. It can be like why we can be like uh, Europe that people. Oh, you, okay, but but we ha do you understand? From, you can drive from Ramallah to Tel Aviv. Okay, to but, walk in Tel Aviv. Right? Okay, but do you understand? We've never been offered anything like a, a state like any other state. We've never been offered that. What we want are equal rights, human rights, and and okay. a state like any other state. And if it's a one-state solution, equal rights, human rights, and and we all have the, uh, one vote, this and that, whatever, you know, just equal rights, human rights, on, you know, in, uh, across the board, no the oppression, no occupation, no apartheid, and the story, and, and that's one state. And I understand, I know that's a lot to ask, and I know, I mean, it's not no, really it's for not the Palestinian people, it, not really, but but I know, but I know it's, it's hard to get to. You're, you're, 
But I know it's going to be tough to get. I know it's going to be tough to get to. But it is more realistic, as I mentioned, than a two-state solution because of all of the deals yeah. that have been. Um, don't, don't don't you prefer to have your uh, your state in the? I prefer West to have equal Bank rights. Gaza. I prefer to have equal With rights the, and human rights. And then the, you will have your national uh, symbols in this state, your national flag, your national anthem, your national identity. You will have peace with the Israelis, and then in the long term, there will be open borders, you know? Like, there, well, there is Palestinians... Well, I, I, I wouldn't even... Israel. Well, you know, the, 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 the right of return comes into play there, but... Uh, we'd be fine with a real the, state, the right though. Of return, as I say, they will have the right to return to the future Palestinian state, probably. But that's the, the, but that's not their like actual home, though. Yeah, but you know, you cannot have all the historical justice. There are many. But there why? Are but why? Refugees. There are six million refugees from Syria, and they are not asking to return to Syria. So, um. Well, it's different. The, yes, it's different. But there are many refugees. Yeah, I mean, there it's it's, many... it's not it's 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 not exactly the, the, the same. But what, I I don't know the particulars is, of yeah, that. Yeah. But what, it is most definitely what, not the what same. Comes ham, what I want to say that there were many refugees problems around the world in the last one hundred years that there are no that already being solved that by not returning to the exact same home, exact same neighborhood, exact same. Uh, a village. Then why did it happen in the first place? You know, I mean, it's like, you know. Because, but, but, but no, but I think because, I think it's the, I, I think it's I say that I think the, it's I possible. I think it is possible. There was there was some misunderstandings. Let's say say it's very okay. 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 I mean, it was just uh, colonization and, and imperialism, but. Um, I, I don't I mean, that's like just, this that's word, just, right? Yeah, I don't either because it's terrible, and that's what Zionism is. But I mean, that's why. I mean, it, it was a rhetorical question. It was a rhetorical question. Anyways, well, I, we, we anyways, we will not agree about this one. Cool. Okay? I mean, yeah, I don't, I don't think we would. Yeah. But but yeah. but anyways, even I, Muhammad the wish uh, back then. I live near to his village, by the way. Uh, didn't ask uh, for both sides to to get the narrative of the other hundred percent. Wait, who? Who? Muhammad Darwish, the national poet of the Palestine. Ma Mahmoud Darwish. Ah, oh, sorry, sorry, Mahmoud. Darwish. No, yeah. Um, I I live yeah. very near to him. His brother live uh, also to this day near to where I live. Okay. By the way. I mean. And. Yeah. You know, things will not be that's the, the that's the idea with compromise. That's the idea that everyone will need to compromise. Okay, that's but it's better than have the, this uh, consistent war for generations. Like why the, the the why people need to be offered better solution. And and I think it starts and with I, I, I think it, I, I think say, it starts with the I, one I, I, it's, I, it starts with I, who has more way, power. I, it starts with who has more power and and, and who can actually lead true. change. And I, that's I, Israel. By the way, I I by the way don't define this myself as a leftist or a peace activist or something of this. On I just a pragmatic Israeli that mm -hmm. that you, you can have this conversation with many Israeli at my age that they care only about the security in the end. We don't want okay, to Okay, well uh, as I mentioned earlier, like we don't you, want you to be, we don't we sure. don't want to be superior to everyone. Sure, the but I, I, as, as as I mentioned earlier, you may care about uh, security, your, your the people may care about security, but the state of Israel, the Zionist state of Israel, the apartheid state of Israel, um the the terrorist state of Israel, they don't. They don't. I mean it it it, it you you see that in in occupied yeah. the the occupied West Bank. You see that in um with 700 we, settlers we living there. We, you understand that that this uh, government we have now it will not last forever. We can choose a better government if we will believe in a peaceful solution. The reason that the right wing but but but, the, but this is, this has been the government since I 1948. Say, I, want one, I, I, I want to mention one thing. You know, the one of the reason Israeli was moved to be more right wing and maybe get into power. It's because of the terror attacks in the 90s of the Islamic Jihad and Hamas that want to d destroy every any opportunity to have a, to get to a peaceful solution. It's because it's, it's because it's because of the rhetoric. Were, uh, it's because of the rhetoric. You know, because of what Bibi did. 
Benjamin Maybe Netanyahu was like, it, it because was of his language. It was before he was uh, get elected to prime minister, and there was like, and by the way, there was sponsored by foreign money back then that didn't want to have peace in this region. They they well, they get they they get you know I, I, by I, having I think... war they get more power. Well, well, once again, man, I think all of this boils down to. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the, the, yeah, what, 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 what does it boil down to? The, the root of the problem, the root of, of days like October 7th and why Hamas exists, because that's what we're talking about, and all of these types of things, right? The root of the problem is 75 plus years of Israel doing terrible things. You know, there's occupation, oppression, humiliation of the Palestinian people, apartheid, and you say that the government will change, but it's been 75 years. Uh, uh, but this, it this, it's been this way for 75 like years, you know? So I don't see any change like happening anytime soon. It was not always like this. You need to understand. The, the government has been the same way for 75 years. It has, oh, it has always been like this. No, the, the Rabin was not like this. and uh, Well, I, I, I agree. Like I agree. This. There may have been, you know, people here and there, like one-offs, you understand? But, but the government, as a government, as an Israeli government, has always been the same for 75 oh. years. They've had the same agenda. You know, but, but by, by the way, Robin, uh, Robin was literally assassinated. He was assassinated. That's true by uh, ex people that were very not uh, legitimate in the by who? society. By who? By who, though? Jewish. Yes, that's true. I no, know. I no. It. But the, but but by but, <laughs> okay. Well, anyways, you mean I, I, by, uh, I mean who who, was, who kind okay. of like who kind of who who kind of um I guess uh, incentivized it to happen. It was a uh, Netanyahu. You you get you want to do this for Oh, well, there you go. Yeah. yeah. So As okay. Said, it was a yeah. It was a cynic leader. Yeah, but it was. Well, do you see how? Okay. Well, if 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 anything, Israelis um are they're more right wing now. I mean, he uh, he literally uh by the way Netanyahu he led protests and said death to to Robin. And then, like three days later, he was assassinated. He, 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 did, he, he did. He didn't say it. Uh, the the crowd say it. Yes, that's all. But uh, he wouldn't be elected. For so he many he years led. Without, he, he led the protests. He led the protests. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, he knew what yeah, he was yeah, doing. He knew what he was doing. Three days later, he got assassinated. Robin got assassinated. He knew what he was doing. Uh, I mean, you said maybe, it. You said it himself. Right. You, you you said it yourself. Uh, the the guy is not the, um, you know, the brightest, and and he had he has he's he's corrupt. He's a cynic. He's a cynic leader. Okay. That, uh, yeah, I mean, I, I mean, I I mean may, maybe I, maybe I mean, he didn't say it word for word, but he didn't condemn it. He didn't stop it. He let the gas burn. He let it happen. He, you know, he once said, this, "The Rabin is not a traitor. He just make a mistakes." I say I'm not a supporter of Netanyahu, but uh, that he, that's what was uh, being uh, told back then that he was. Rabin is not a traitor; he's just making a huge mistake. He said it once, but yes, he, there was a lot of insight from his uh, side of the political. Uh, well, I I, th I think I think it's indirectly, at the very least, because of him, because of uh, Benjamin Netanyahu. The, the, yeah, but the reason is, you know. but the reason is, but anyways, like in power for so many years, it's also because people lose their uh, hope for mm -hmm. a for a solution. That's one of the reason he's in power. Um, uh, that's why it's I, the reason. If you if you guys will come and speak with average Israelis, uh, don't go to, to the extreme settlers. Well, once, some, once uh, again, once again, I understand. Some, I, under, some, I understand that some, the people. Some, some settlers, some settlers say, yeah, hey, okay, we'll, give, well, okay. If, if you a, ask me, if you if you ask me, the entire government needs to be replaced because the system is is broken completely. No, I I also this current government, I don't like it. I, exactly. I might, okay. I don't like. This I mean, I mean, you but, may not like it but, for the but, for the same reasons, but it's just completely broken. No, I, I don't like it. One of the reasons I don't like it, uh, it's because uh, also because of the idea of uh, peace and democracy. It's one of the reasons I don't like this government. That's true. I, it's got, but for me, mm -hmm. for the well, well, what, what, what I having, what, what I what I want a one-state solution, yeah. right? But 
but I'm talking like a, a new country down to the constitution. The governments need to be completely replaced. The the everything that is going on yeah, yeah, in Israel I, now. I, 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 I don't even. I don't I even trust. I don't you. even trust the PA. I don't trust Israel. We need a yeah, new I, country. No, no, no more of of uh, of what's going on right now. And whether whether that be Palestine, it's whatever, as long as we have equal rights, happen, you know. Uh, things like this can happen only in the very long term after the trust will be built. And for this being making this to happen, mm -hmm. sorry. People like Palestinians and Israelis need to speak with each other. The average person, you know, that. Well, uh, well, well, as I mentioned earlier, it is happening, but uh, I mean, obviously, very in a very small number. Like I mean, that. it's happening. It's it's still happening, but but that's it, it. It still doesn't change the government. Once again, I understand the people that there are people out there that support. Um, the Palestinian people and, and people have even uh, admitted to the occupation and, and the apartheid in Israel and, and all of these things. I, I've I, I've met people like that. I mean, a very minority, very, very minority. But I know that they exist. But even with them existing, the leadership, the government is the same and will always be the same. Um, it's not we, be the same. Un well, until it's not. until there's a free Palestine, until it's been until it's dismantled and, and it's a brand new country. You know, like a new country, as I mentioned, like literally down to the constitution. I mean, it's been the same for yeah, for seventy five years. Because you, you look at the, this is a system, a systematic Zionist uh, system, something like this that that is not really true. The, the, this not really true. I mean, I, I mean, it is, but the, the government and and not really, not really, because well, uh, we can have a different government. You know. Well, we but but it's but I I understand you're saying that can this can that whatever, but it's been yeah. the same it's been the same for seventy five years. You know the occupation continued and continued, right? And, and the murder continued. Uh, the, the, even the leftist prime minister is a Zionist. They will continue the occupation in some way. Leftist, rightist, wherever you are on that on that on that uh, that scale, you are a Zionist at the end of the day. If you are uh, the leaders that we've seen. The, um, you know, uh, and, and I, I, I said, like, Zionist, Zionism have a lot of meaning. Uh, the many people. Well, it has. Zion, they're also having a democracy, being a Zionism. <laughs> the, it's also uh, a democracy. I, I, Zionism, I wouldn't but, agree. Zionism, but it's that, basically but, the, the, um, the Jews need to return just... to their homeland. It's nothing more than this. Uh -huh. than well, I, I, well honestly. Well, honestly, I, I don't even think it's a matter of uh, agreeing or disagreeing. I, I, that's just not true. Oh, the, 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 you know, Zionism. I mean, you can just say, okay, let, let me yeah, let me yeah, ask yeah. you. Let me ask you something. Let me ask you something. Um, yeah. Who does Israel, I guess, benefit more, the U.S. or the Jewish people? I don't know. Who they benefit more from the Jewish people or the U.S. Yeah, who does Israel benefit more, the the U.S. or the Jewish people? In the grand, That's in the in the answer. grand, in the grand scheme of things. Well, it's hard to answer, but I think the U.S. want a solution to this conflict. Like, I don't know how to. I you think like uh, we are more beneficial to the U.S. Well, for, than the Zionists, the the Jewish people. Do you do I what? Thing? No, no, no. I I mean, who is who is benefiting from the existence of Israel? The U.S. Well, the U.S. Also, or the Jewish people? I think also the Jewish people. But but who more? Who more? I don't know. I don't think it's the U.S. Because why? They can have different. Uh, they can have alliances. With you don't. You, you don't. To. You don't think the U.S. is benefiting more from the existence of Israel than the Jewish people? Uh, I don't think so. Cause they, why they need us? You know, I, I mean, you you don't think Israel helps the U.S. with their imperialism? It, it is literally a beacon yeah. of the West. That's what they call it. Their some, strongest ally it, in the Middle East. Some some people in the U.S. they also have alliances with the Emirates and the Saudis and the other countries. Yeah, but the, the, so, Israel is the strongest ally. In, in the Middle East and and is basically uh, an extension um, to to the U.S. I mean and, and yeah sure they may have uh, these whatever uh, 
you know, I guess deals yeah, deals with other yeah, other out of countries, but but they don't talk you know, the, about the, them the, the same way. If there wasn't the, an, uh, the, an Israel, then U.S. The influence bigger, in the, the uh, in the um the, the biggest military base I think of the U.S. in the Middle East is in Qatar. I think. No, no. Well, the strongest yeah. the strongest ally, once again, is Israel. Um, and if there wasn't an Israel. Yeah. Then the U then U.S. influence in the Middle East would fall. You know, well, and, and I'm talking about I, I mean, I'm geopolitical ally, not about bases or whatever. That's that's not what I'm talking about. Okay, but don't you you see the um, the U.S. as the source for all the evil evil things that happening in this uh, region? Like, I think. Well, I, I think well, I think I think it's a. I think it's a big part of it. I think the U.S. is, um, I mean, yeah, but I'm not, I, that's not what I'm talking about. But yes, I do think, I mean, they're literally funding Israel. Israel is, is getting all of their, their moolah from fucking, from the U.S. So, I mean, yeah, but but I'm, I'm saying that the Jewish people are ironically second from what I see. U.S. is first. I don't agree with this. This is where you are, you're really entering into a very complicated uh, thing. You know, the, if the influence of America in this region is good or bad, this is like totally <laughs> political uh, debate for well, a, for a different. Uh, well, I'm not. I'm not saying good or. I'm not saying good or bad. That's not my point. Ah. I don't think that the U.S. have uh, like their influence is uh, necessarily a bad one. You know, I must agree that you know that uh, maybe Trump was li uh, more uh, problematic. But I but, but I, I'm not. I'm not even. I'm I not, I think Biden and Harris also want uh, just a uh, solution. But but I'm not, I'm not even talking about that. So like what I, 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 I'm, I'm saying that the U.S. is benefiting from Israel more than the Jewish See? people. So about that, I don't agree because they don't. I don't feel well, like the U.S. is benefiting than us more than we benefit from our country because we need a, we need a, our homeland. There is a lot of racism in the world. I don't know if you know it, but I'm in this platform. Do you don't think Israel is making that worse? It was before Israel. Yeah, the racism was, against Jews was uh -huh. before Israel. But you don't think Israel and is making that for... worse, though? Uh, well, what about safety? Uh, about what about safety? Safety. We said the worst day. The, what happened? You know, it takes seventy-five, one hundred years of Zionism. It doesn't uh, like one day in Auschwitz. The amount of casualties. Um. Well. Well, no, no. What I mean is, I mean, you you said that that and all the, the neighbors and, and, and went you know, to attack and, Israel. And, and, and you, you know, I, I've been in I've you, been you, in Europe. No one likes Israel in that region, right? I guess. I mean, I mean you're saying you you, you said that you said all the neighbors want to attack Israel. So so the, many of them so want, isn't Israel yeah, failing in their goal? Maybe I, I, as a, I mean, as a safe space for the Jewish people. Israel. Well, uh, they want to be attacked it, uh, by all of their neighboring yeah, the, countries. I mean, is that not safe the, for them? But, but there was a, there is attack against Jews also in America. The, they are not there, you know. Haredi, yeah, yeah, but that's like, the, Orthodox, once again. I mean, that's not my point. Orthodox, Orthodox, Orthodox Jews in New York being attacked. Mm. They probably are not Zionist, uh, believe it or not, and they are being attacked by pure racism. But there is also Islamophobia. It's the. It's I mean, yeah, I, the I, I, I agree. I agree. But uh, for the Jews in our history, we take it very and, serious. And and and, and the idea of soldiers are dying and Israelis are dying. As I say, it's terrible, but it's not comparable to what happened in in uh, Europe not so long ago. You know, mm -hmm. you understand. If you ask average Israelis, we prefer to die as soldiers and not to die as uh, civilians in some European country being led like uh, being led to death because we are Jews. This is part of our uh, national uh, memory. I mean, you can't you, you you can't compare that. Um... I can't. 
I compare it. But, but, but I, I mean, I agree. I agree with 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 um, I guess the the gist, you know, uh, uh, you know, obviously. But but I mean, I don't think it's a comparison, though. So it's very complicated, you know. It's for it's for a different uh -huh. debate. But we as the Jews believe uh -huh. to having our okay. our okay. country Anyways. with our with our army, it's better than not than being in the diaspora. Uh -huh. That's what we believe. And yeah, I, I think that the best thing is to have peace with our neighbors. That's for sure. That will. So that and, will and, and once again, what 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 is what is the common denominator when it comes to to um. You know all of the issues. Pal so... Pal Palestinian refugees and Palestinians, right? I mean, that's like, isn't that not the common so, yeah, denominator? That, so, 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 if we if we fix that, if we help Palestine, and and um, if, and, if and we, we give them an actual state, if we give them freedom and equal rights and human rights, then then there there would be. No, there there would be peace in the Levant. So, yeah, I, I truly would... believe that. I really I truly believe that. But but. So yeah, having yeah. peace with the Palestinians will bring the end to the, our two thousand years of suffering. That's what I also I believe. Okay. This is what will bring the end for I mean, the suffering. I mean, two thousand years. I mean, okay. All right. So so. Like you know, I Any, don't anyways. know how much you read about Jewish history, but we were. Yeah, yeah, but the ancient the ancient there. Hebrews are not the same as the ones um, living in Israel today. But we consider that you know we consider ourselves also gen genetically I mean, uh, we have a connection to, to we have Jews have more connection genetically to the Middle East than to Europe. I, I'm I'm also gen gen genetically uh, connected. I would say that I'm more connected to ancient Hebrews than the people living in Israel right now as a Palestinian. Did you did you make like a DNA test? Maybe you right, You know we mixed. With I, I I've and, I've. Uh, uh, I mean, my, my family, the, I mean, solely for the reason that my family consistently lived there. That This is every Palestinian, not just me. Well, some Palestinians came here like uh, later, like in the 19th and the 18th century. M minority, minority. Well, I don't going, I'm not going to check everyone's DNA and by this say you don't have the right or you have the right. Well, I mean... Jews you know that the, 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 in the end they're part of the palestinians the society that live here and i don't care if he came from uh, egypt uh, 150 uh, years ago or he's here for uh, 1000 years that's that and that you should not care that he, like if my grand grandmother was like me was partly german you know in the end we have some middle eastern culture and some middle eastern uh, i mean i mean i agree I, I, I agree i shouldn't care um, you know, but it's it, 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 that that's why the argument of connection is stupid, and and yeah, and and bringing it, back two thousand years ago, I, I don't want to have to say that um, I I have more of a connection uh, to I ancient Hebrews than I, people I living I, there. I, but I, I, I shouldn't uh, have to argue that, you know, because no connection, two, no connection outweighs the I other. Say, no claim justifies displacement. Is my no, no, I, whole I, thing. I don't uh, about that. We can agree. I don't claim that because some Jews have been here two thousand years ago. It's make the Nakba. It justified what happened in 1948 to the uh, Palestinians. Well, but but that's what the Zionists end up, ended up I, doing, but, uh, 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 right? Just saying that in our narrative, in our narrative, the, the losing our historical homeland and we stay as a well. Well, well, Jews well once again, the ancient he Hebrews are not the same as the ones living there today. But but, but, but your your well, narrative your narrative is a romanticized narrative, and and I think I think it's not really because you know and and, and I think I think like, even. Like you said, like you said, Jewish people in the Middle East didn't care about Zionism, right? Because Zionism people. wasn't about the Jewish people, right? It, they, it was about they European did, no, imperialism. They also, they also, for a religion uh, point of view, not the Yemenis, but most of the Jews believe that uh, we should not rebuild our homeland till the Messiah will come. That's uh, the reason why they didn't yeah. care about. They, I mean, that's um, they were very religious. I, I know, I know they that argument. Very, I know it, that it's argument. Not, it, it, it's not because they don't think they have connection to to the I, ancient I, I, peoples. I, I, I mean, I understand. It, it, I understand. I, I know. Said, okay. I know that argument. I know that argument. But they, they, but, but, they, but, but they believe, no matter what they believe, no matter what the Torah believe, says, I, I know what you're saying. No, they, I know. I know what you're saying. They no. I want to. I want to add something. Okay. They believe that the Jewish values are more important than the Jewish state. That's like, uh, and this, that, that's a big dispute because sometimes we cannot have 
without the states our existence uh, is in danger once again once again uh, one, once again listen you, you, you know the 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 whole thing with 2000 years ago um is not a justification to displace palestinians right uh, the Nekba, the Nekba is not a justification, and I know that you're saying it's. You agree it's not, but unfortunately, that's what the Zionists ended up doing. They, they, you know, minor, this is kind minor, of minority. No, minority of them. No, no. I think that I think in whole, in whole, I think, and and I think that's also the main, um, the main thing with with brainwashing, uh, the the brainwashing of, of the Israeli people, and and, and having that argument stuck in their heads and and having a justification for the nakba or not even knowing about the nakba you know not even being taught about it and and that's a whole other topic with with israeli education and and why that's also not going to help us get anywhere because you keep saying you what we want to see more palestinians talk to israelis but how about we see the israelis actually learn about the palestinian um history right from israeli education why is that not in the well i think we we learn but we learn most of us learn about you know the palestinian well history. i think i think Everywhere. those that those that have to go out of their way do but but i i'm talking about putting it into the history books and and like uh, i i know uh, more about israeli uh, history uh, than israelis uh, than israelis know about palestinian history you know and, every, and, and you live israeli on the land you live on historic palestine and i yeah, feel like that's an issue i think it's very problematic the average israelis in this platform are not uh, here to have academic uh, 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 argument you know it's like it's, it's just young people that want to entertain themselves i think i'm the only uh, boomer here that uh, really looking to speak with people and know their uh, point of view well isn't that a problem uh, well it is of course it is yeah i mean and but, and and, but and the, the, the kids anyways like, the kids the, the 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 people i meet down here the, the the teenagers the the even adults after they've left school they told me about about the education uh system um they, they said how the books talk about it and how they how the nekba isn't even mentioned and when it is it's the um uh, it, it is glorified and rom romanticized and and they told me how it doesn't even show the west bank it doesn't show the occupation you know about the occupation surprisingly you have a, almost a, in almost every map you have like the gaza and the west bank have the you have the green line yeah, that is uh, well when you look at netanyahu map. showing off the israeli map you know and, and it's like all of israel and there and Gaza and West Bank is not even like you know clarified on that. I you know, but 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 anyways. But in schools yeah, but though, in the, schools, what about what about out. what about Judea and Samaria, right? Well, what about that? That's that's the West Bank, and that's what people are taught to believe the names are, and, and that it's a part of Israel and yeah, it's Israeli it's, and whatever. You know, isn't that what the books the, show it as Judea and Samaria? Yeah, but it's the, it's the, it's the same with Palestine. Uh, Palestinians call uh, call don't say that say that Israel is not exist. It's well, all well once again, that's a completely place. different situation because the Nekba and we were displaced and we are occupied and we are oppressed and we're humiliated. Can't and there's apartheid, like a and and there's a are you, you know it, it, it's, you, it's a different situation. You you cannot compare the the two. You really can't. Is your is your, uh, is your family personal is like uh, from a refugees family? No, from the West Bank. Yeah, but not uh, refugees from the we, from uh, forty eight. Not, not 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 designated refugees in the diaspora. Okay. Yes. Yeah, and do you li how long do you live in the states? Like I was born here. I was born here. Mm, okay, because I guess it's changed a lot of on your like uh, point of view. What do you mean? Yeah. What? What do you mean? You you have like a more Western thinking. I well, I, I lived in the <laughs> in in the Middle East for ten years, but um, uh, but 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 every you, Palestinian, um. You know, why, and they're like, why, they're, 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 why this is family... this is popular with Palestinians no matter where they live. Like my my ideology or whatever yeah, my thoughts yeah, or whatever no, the, whatever I'm saying and that you agree with. I mean, no, they, it's, it's, uh -huh. it's part of your identity. It's, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But 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 everyone you know. everyone wants a one state equal rights. Nobody wants to kick anyone out. I mean, if you're going to talk about Gaza, that's very different. Once again, um, you know, those yeah, people are being in bombed and genocided, and they've been blockaded. Yeah, yeah, they, Gaza, they, Gaza. they can, they, yeah. they can say whatever they. They're being 
I mean, come on. You cannot. Uh, they're not even worried about that, by the way. They're, they're worried about yeah, yeah, food and water and Gaza electricity and, and hunger, Gaza you know? Uh, Gaza, yeah. Gaza, it's very different. Well, and I can, just I can in case that. that point was going to be brought on, I just wanted to clarify. But, but the, and, and the West Bank is also similar. But there were interviews, and, and they, but, but even them, they want equal rights and they want, they don't want to kick anyone out. But there, there were interviews. And they explained what a one state solution meant, one state equal rights, um, uh, whoever wants to stay and live together in peace as equals, you know, if you go back to the terrorists from the 70s, there were interviews. Okay, that, that, yeah. yeah, I know, like, that's what... Uh, yeah, and, and th Arafat, those were pal Palestinian even, leaders, which are, I guess... Even, yeah, yeah, even, know, even Arafat said that uh, in some time that the, the future Palestinian state will be uh, like with equal rights and it uh -huh. will be a democracy. Uh -huh. But we, we, we didn't believe him, <laughs> fortunately. Well, that's a problem. I think that... Uh, that you know but there, there is a re there is a reason why we didn't believe him but now that's why i i think that so, more people so, need to but are there not reasons other. why are there not reasons why we shouldn't believe um you know peace treaties that come from uh israel and when they say they're going to do something and they never do i mean if you look at um well, yeah yeah there is know, lots of mis I, mean, I mean many yes. palestinians by the way they are also they don't like uh arafat arafat anymore so it's it's a little different with him but i don't know anyways man like what uh yes it of fact mm. yeah okay. um but yeah man man we've been speaking for quite a while now and i'm really tired yeah, yeah. um yeah, last video from San Wayne, because from of by the way because of corruption like fat fat and and uh, and all of that but anyways i just want to like say why i guess but you take it down uh, like the the last video from three days ago yeah, my stream because at the end of it, yeah. at the end of it, like this, there was someone smoking, and uh, uh, YouTube doesn't allow that. It, it wasn't. Uh, it wasn't okay. just little smoking. He was like doing. Um, he was like doing like the illegal smoking. So it was. I I can't have that on yeah. on stream. And then okay, and then let's, let's, and then the let's... stream before that, um, someone flashed there something something happened like something popped up on the stream ah, okay, and it's like okay. it's inappropriate so, like, like, so i never remove my streams unless something like that happens i don't remove it for any ah, other okay. reason yes okay okay because uh, okay so let's uh, sum it up i think i want to say that if more israelis and palestinians will speak with each other respectfully that can change the political system in israel for sure i mean i mean i think it's i think the education needs to change <laughs> Because because what what what's, what's what this is gonna do? Let's say Palestinians do speak to Israelis, right? Israelis are just gonna say you're wrong, you're wrong, you're wrong, because they're taught this, right? And and, and so, that's the, that's where it's wrong. That's where that needs to be fixed. So so I think it's happening. People are speaking to each other, but I think it's gonna be very hard with the education that is being taught to the Israelis. Yeah, there, there, are, there are different narratives. That's true. But if you if well, no, I I think I don't. I mean, dialogue is is important, you know. But unfortunately, Israel needs to be forced into dialogue, and and that's the problem. That's where conversations are harder to start. Like the first intifada, uh, by the way, it, it forced Oslo, right? Yeah. And and it, and it wouldn't have happened Madrid, otherwise. Madrid. It 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 would not have happened otherwise. And and that's Maybe, what people need to to you know. The context is important. Learning the history of. Of why things happen and, and not starting uh history i guess on on a and specific also, date also, is important and we have to talk about why things also, are happening and we need to scream also, louder and louder you know also respecting different narratives you know because i know what the well, palestinians been through well that's, well that's i mean there's a difference i think between narratives and history and what actually happened and what i'm telling you is all factual in my opinion i think i don't think i've said anything okay. not factual i think you agreed with a lot of what i was saying um but I agree with some of what you're saying some okay <laughs> Uh, but but I understand oh, you have your own narrative. I understand that. Um, but 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 it is a it is a, a romanticized narrative. It is not the truth. You know, yeah, it's a know, myth that they myth, built. They built myth, it. And you live myth. in Israel, so I don't blame. I mean, I you know, yeah, making, you're old enough. Making, I feel like you know, I you are to blame at this making, point. But making a movie like Tantura is like showing you that the Israelis are challenging their narrative. You know, it was Israel. It was made by Israel. Yeah, yeah, know, yeah. Uh, and Israeli historians like Elon Pape. Yeah, I mean that's my point. We need more of that. But it's like or not, we we no, we need to continue it. 
There is many Israelis that you know they are more open-minded to to conversation to to challenge their narrative. Otherwise, you know. Um. We didn't say- once again, it's 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 gonna be tough with the education that is is in Israel and and everything that they are um, being taught. You know, they're not gonna be. It, it's like much harder to hold a conversation and move on. Like the amount of people I've spoken to on here is crazy. And the only times I've ever had a conversation like this is now and maybe one other time, you know. Uh, but anyways, I, I really need to I really need to sleep. Um, it's okay. late here. I need to say like goodnight well, to my stream well, and, and end it. Well, uh, it was nice to talk to you. I hope this will be on YouTube. Yes, and, no, th- this uh, will be on YouTube unless I, I accidentally mm-hmm. skip and then something shows. But I'm going to like probably yeah. end it here anyway. So, okay. yeah, you know, you, okay, you'll, you'll, you'll see right. this on YouTube. Okay, and hopefully yeah. you can have the opportunity to visit your... Your counter, so. Inshallah. Inshallah, and a free Palestine. One state, equal rights, inshallah. Well, I say equal rights to states, but... Okay, then... then, then, then well, well, equal rights to states you, means no, with a security it, 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 and, and all that. But but anyways... Equal rights and uh, no violent solution. No displacement of uh, anyone. Okay. I mean... Let's that, that, uh, sum it this way. Free Palestine. From from the river to the sea, Palestine will be free, inshallah. Anyways, man, you take it easy, okay? Uh, peace and love. All right. See you. Bye. Okay. That was a very long conversation, man. I don't know. How long was that? Does anyone even know? When did I start speaking to him? That was a long conversation. Um... I don't know. That was that was definitely nearly like two hours or like around two hours. I don't even know. That was that was. I think that was one of the the more, I guess, chill uh, conversations I've had. No yelling involved, which was um, nice to see. But um, you know, yeah, I, I I think it's it's just once again conversations like this. It's really hard to move on at, at, with, with certain topics like Zionism, for example, or 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 you know, um, the government or, or I don't know, other other topics that we kind of like didn't really agree on, I guess. It's hard to move past that with the education in Israel. And I think that's a very important topic. That education is terrible. And they teach you what they want to teach you. They show you what they want to show you. And they don't show you what they don't want to show you. And the news outlets and, and the media, I think all of that is a problem. And I think that's that's why we couldn't really move past a few things in this conversation. But... Yeah, I mean that wasn't that wasn't um, um, the worst at all. I mean, that, I think that was that was all right. I mean, maybe he learned something. I hope he did. You know that that'd be nice. Um, but anyways, guys, I do have to go to sleep. Before I go to sleep, I want to thank the people that have donated while uh, I was streaming that I did not read out. I am sorry about that. Let me thank some people that donated. Okay, we have. Um, Yeah, I I hope I I hope he uh, learned something. Actually, honestly, wallah, I, I I hope maybe it sparked something to go do some more research on on a lot. But yeah, that was good. Anyways, let me thank the donations. Here we go. We got uh, Marcel with the ten dollar donation, saying uh, keep on planting olive trees and giving meals to the people in, in Palestine. Much love from Holland. Much love to, to Marcel in the chat. M-A-R-C-E-L. Much love to Marcel in the chat right now. Let's get some hype in the chat for him. I appreciate that donation. That very, very generous donation. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, Ayan in the chat. Thank you for your donation. Uh, Jom say thank you for your donation. I appreciate the $2 donation. Thank you. Uh, Brave Balls with the membership. Thank you for that. Uh, Celestial Teddy. Thank you for the donation saying... Um, It's actually it's six hundred plus. Actually, they retracted the twelve hundred statement. I don't know what you're talking about exactly. Um, sounds like it has to do with the with the death toll of uh, October seventh, but I believe it is twelve hundred. I don't believe it's anything lower than. I think it's actually eleven eleven hundred and I think a thousand one hundred and thirty nine. I don't know if it's anything lower than that. From as I mean, that's what I'm kept up to date with. I will like check and make sure, but maybe I don't know. Thank you for the donation, uh, anyways. Thank you. 
Uh, Prime Sue, thank you for the donation. I appreciate that. I will. Thank you. Uh, MB, thank you for the $5 dono, saying, um, I guess ha uh, Hamza is everywhere now. Free Palestine. Free Palestine. Let's go. I appreciate that, MB. Thank you for the $5 donation. Sorry, guys. I'm very stiff. I've just been sitting down. Uh, CM with the membership. I appreciate that. CM, thank you. Uh, Tizer, thank you for your donation. Uh, CM with the gifted membership. Let's go. I appreciate that. Much love in the chat for CM. Um, MMT, we got uh, Pro CB. Thank you for your don donation. Saying free Palestine. I appreciate you guys. Wallah. You guys are amazing. Um, and I know you guys want me to continue. Wallah, I understand. I get it. But um, I can't. I simply cannot. Um, yeah, I simply cannot just because I have to go to sleep, wallah. But I will keep this stream up if anyone wants to watch this afterwards. Um, because nothing inappropriate was shown, I don't think. I think we heard some stuff, but I was covering the screen, so I think we're good there. But I did want to mention, I want to thank some people that bought some merch today. Um, so if you guys do want to go ahead and get yourself some Palestine merch, some Palestinian merch, some Pali merch, uh, let me get them real quick to show you. Uh, every order, by the way, every order plants an olive tree in Palestine and, and, and donates a meal to families, um, meals, uh, plural, to families in Gaza from allthingspalestine.com. Um, we have shirts like this that says Free Palestine. Really amazing material. Very, very soft. I swear. I promise I'm not just saying that. If you have this, you know how soft this is. Um, we have this in shirts. We have this in sweatshirts. We have this in hoodies. You can get this from the link in the description down below. The first link in the description down below. Or you can use the... Um, or you can click... Uh, or not click. Type this in, which is on the screen right now. Allthingspalestine.com Or you can type that in. Um... So yeah, definitely uh, look into this. this. This is amazing. We have more designs, not just this. We also have watermelon designs. I'll get that in a second. Let me get that and show you. I don't know if I have it with me, but if I do, I think I have it. No, no, this is something. This is another design we have. This is another design we have. Um, this is the Palestine map. I have it on my necklace right here. This is the, pal the, the map of Palestine in kafia form. It's also embroidered. And the quality, once again, is amazing. I recommend it. We have this in shirts. We have this in hoodies um, and and uh, phone cases. Even we have it in different colors. Even the other hoodies and shirts. And we also have yeah, we have we have phone cases just like this, right? We have phone cases. This is a watermelon with an olive tree. If you guys are wondering what that is, um, and yeah, for every order, no matter what you buy, plants an olive tree in Palestine and donates meals to families in Gaza. So definitely go click the first link in the description down below and click this link right here. Well, not click it. You can't click this, but go to allthingspalestine.com. Um, and this design we have on shirts. We have this design on shirts. We have this design on, on hoodies, on, on sweatshirts. So definitely look into that. Let me try finding a sweatshirt. Okay, yeah, and we also have we also have the Palestine map in in watermelon form. Look at that. So you see, I have a watermelon in the back right here. Well, that's because the watermelon symbolizes the the flag of the uh, of Palestine. I'm sure you guys know all of this. It has the same colors as as the flag of, uh, of Palestine. So we have um, this was very dusty. I just like put dust everywhere. Man, I gotta like I gotta, like fold these. Man, <laughs> I just toss them after a stream. So. A Palestine map, watermelon, embroidered as well. Uh, what else? What else we got? What else we got? What else we got? We got more free Palestine. We got more free Palestine. We have this in black as well. Um, okay, here it is. Here it is. The watermelon. Look at that. This is the cleanest design in my opinion. This is my favorite design. Um, look at that. This is amazing. I love this. I might wear it next stream, actually. The quality, I mean, I don't know if you can tell through the screen, but like, if you have this, if you have this, you know how smooth this is. Um, allthingspalestine.com, if you buy anything right now, I will shout you out. I'll read your name. Not your last name for, for privacy reasons, for security reasons, so don't worry. But um, 
I will read your name. So get this. Get it. Should I should I put a discount? Should I put a discount code? Yes or no, chat? I'll put a discount code for like 10 minutes, okay? Here, 10 minute discount code. 10 minutes, 10 minutes. Let me put a discount code. Um Actually, no, 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 not 10 minutes. That's too much, guys. That is too much. Here, I'll I'll do a discount code for like We'll do a discount code for 1 minute. 1 minute discount code. And it's going to be a lot. It'll it'll be no, 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 let me start with a five-minute one. No, let me just do one. Which one? What should I do, man? What should I do? I need to decide real quick. I need to decide. We'll do a discount for 15% off. And it will last for five minutes on the clock, okay? Okay, it's active. It's active. Five minutes starting now. Gaza15 is the code. I'm going to start the timer. You guys have five minutes. You guys have five minutes. I'm, I'm starting the timer right now. Five minutes. And then I'm going to disable the code. Everything on the website is 15% off. Link is in the description. Be quick. Be quick. Yalla, be quick. Be quick. Yeah, Jama, you have to be the first people. Be the first people. I'll I'll keep you guys updated. You guys have four minutes and thirty seconds now. My bad. If I scared anyone of that, I'm sorry. I will read everyone's name that buys at anything. Um only your first name for privacy reasons and security reasons, so don't worry. And um, for every order, once again, you plant one olive tree in Palestine, in Palestine, and you donate meals to families in Gaza. With every order, no matter what you buy, a phone case, a hat, we have mugs with this design. Um, yeah. I'll be right back, guys, okay? Give me one second. One... Two, two, two. Testing, testing. Testing, testing. Hold on. Hmm. That's weird. Testing, testing. I just realized I'm going to get copyrighted for that. Too late at this point. Too late. Way too late. It's okay.
Okay. It has been, um, oh man, I'm tired. It's been five minutes. I'm going to disable the code now. I'm going to thank the people that, that purchased anything. All right, we got Sarah. We got uh, Mirjam. We got Farah. We have Esad. We have Aisha. We have Nadia, Walid, Isa, Anna, Nadia, Sarah, um, Isa. We have uh, Valerie. We have uh, Abir and, and Salman. Appreciate you guys. Appreciate you guys. Should I do a gift card? I'm going to do a gift card. I want to give you guys some gift cards in the chat, okay? I will still plant a, a tree on, on your behalf and, and donate the meals, um, but I'm going to give someone a gift card to buy something for free online. Um, and, and be careful when you press, like, purchase. Make sure you have the gift card. Make sure, because, you know, it, it might get taken up immediately. You have to be the first one to get it, okay? I'm going to make a gift card code. It's going to be Palestine 500, and it's going to be um, $75, okay? Ready? Three, two, one, now. It's a thing. Palestine 500 is the code. You got to be quick. You got to go like right now. So. What happened to the tech? What? Was that text not always there? That's so weird. Do I have another OBS open? Hmm. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. That's so weird. It, was this link not always here? Did it just pop up? I don't know. 500, guys. Palestine 500, not 100. 500. It was? Oh, okay. But when did it go away? Why did it why did it go away? Someone's hacking me, bro. Um Okay. So two people used it. Two people used the code. Uh, we have Rochelle. Rochelle, back at it again. Got another shirt. That's amazing. Um, unless that's a different Rochelle. I don't. I don't think so though. Rochelle got a Kofia Palestine map T-shirt. Amazing. And then Andrew got a free Palestine T-shirt. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, so it's used up already. It's empty. Um, I mean, it has like $2 on it, but I just deactivated it so no one can use it anymore. I, I will... Should I make another one? I don't know. Should, should I give you guys like a, a head start before? Should I, get, should I give you guys a head start before?
Welcome Arafat. How are you doing, Arafat? What? Can you uh, put the smoky away? No, I won't. Arafat, I'm not smoking uh, my. You're you're, you're addicted, bro. Arafat is Arafat. You're addicted. You don't wanna be on stream on camera. What? Do you wanna be on stream? Eh, hey, why not? You have to, don't smoke then. I will. Okay, bye. Because I'm not allowed to put him on if he's smoking. Anyways.
Um, shout out to Fred, Ivana, Alyssa, Andrew, and Rochelle. Much love, guys. Okay. All right, guys. I think I'm going to end the stream here. Yeah, I'll let you guys take it easy, okay? I'm going to go to sleep. I Listen, it's 4 a.m. and I'm tired, but I might stream on my phone for a little bit before I sleep. What time, what's my phone at? 12%? Let me charge it, and then maybe I'll stream. I don't know. Um, I don't know, man. No, don't. What, what do you mean? Oh, I can't stream on my... I got banned. I got banned. They gotta unban me. I gotta sleep. They gotta unban me, bro. That's right. Such an L, bro. Such an L. Why banned? Because I'm talking about Philistine. I have something growing over here. Oh my god. Stress pimple. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I don't like it. I don't like it. It's annoying. I know I, if I touch it, it'll get worse, but. It's like I feel it. It's better, like. <sighs> Anyways. Yeah, look, guys, you take it easy, okay? RZ, you take it easy. I'm gonna go to sleep now. Love you guys. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Yalla, sit down. Free pals, free Palestine. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free, inshallah. Bye.